Talmites is basically they are uh, Templars, right? Because they are a religious, religious militaristic order, right? So the, the priests are knights and they have uh, martial abilities, you know? So it's a place of like soldiers, nice temple. right? And what you know, uh, Alwyn, is that the High Hall, that is the place where you were walking, right? Because you were trying to reach the High Hall, that is the that castle that you see under a hill, right? Uh, that is very visible in the city, that is partially destroyed. That place is not only the, 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 the location of the government of Eutrell, but also a uh, cathedral of Thorn. Right, so is also very important for those one who worship Torm. That was the cop, yeah. the, the 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 Owens yeah. uh, case before he was controlled by Durithil. Uh So yes, this priest is asking you to bring to get this armor, uh, these weapons, and bring to the Helmites in the Helm Shield Helm. Right, but he's extremely frightened, and you were heading to the high hall. So you, this, you were discussing this. What, what are you gonna do? We're going to help him. We're going to say him fuck off. <coughs> already, we were discussing we've already that. Filled, you were, already another filled. thing. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, you, another thing, and you were in a hurry because you know that devils can reach this place and at any moment. Mm. So we filled. I filled the bag with as much as what would fit, and it's it's just some portion of the uh, the weapons. Mm -hmm. So you can you can take all the weapons, right? Because you found kind of uh, you found uh, I, just for those one who wasn't here, uh, twenty great swords, twenty great axes, twenty short swords, ten lances, ten halberds. 50 long swords, 20 heavy crossbows, 20 light crossbows, 20 long bows, 300 uh, ammunition for each one of the long ranged weapons, and 50 silver bullets to this. That's bullets, but it's basically small spheres, right? Mm -hmm. uh, for the weapon, for this rifle or so, right? It, 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 uh, let's say, in the in the world of uh, Forgotten Realms, in, here in Faerun, Firearms are not uh, allowed. No, not common. It, oh. It's not the kind of thing that you're gonna find easily in anywhere. But it's so, especially those one with martial uh, uh, proficiency, proficiency with martial weapons. They can, they know more or less how to to deal with this, right? You heard about it. You know more or less how to work with it, right? So I would allow you to uh, deal with this firearms, and you see, this is basically a Renaissance weapon. So it's like a Renaissance rifle, right? It's it's not a, a like a modern rifle. So it's you must no right you you must to put the bullet, put the 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 the, the, the powder, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then, oh, yes. Is uh, right. is smoke powder still considered like a magical? Um, uh, item? No, it's not considered a, a, a magical item. It is because it's just regular smoke powder. Okay, so it is gun. So it is it is consi it is gunpowder, not yeah, smoke it's powder. powder. Yeah, it's gunpowder. Yeah, yeah, gunpowder. Sorry. And we have uh, that. It's assumed that when you have fifty bullets, you have the powder to go with. Yeah, you'll have a small a small mm -hmm. bag of okay. powder. Yes, yeah. but remember, it's mm. like a, an old Renaissance rifle that you must put. So even this have the reload property, but the reload is for mm. one shot. So reload property works uh, uh, this way. You can use it this as an action or a bonus action. You choose it, and then you. So we're gonna use as a bonus action to reload and an action to shoot, right? And one shot, just one. Mm-hmm. I mean, it, it does two D ten damage, but yeah, but have this have this mechanically issue, right? One bonus action to load it, one action to shoot. 
Yeah. So you can't you can't multiple attack. The point is you can't not multiple attack with this weapon. No. Right. You, yeah, well, yeah, that's, one that's shot. The, I mean, you can't multi attack yeah, just, with crossbows either, though. Yeah, yeah. Anything with the reload. Yeah. Anything yeah. With the reload. Yeah, but so the reload has this feet, issue, which yeah. is what? What is it? Fast? There's like a fast shot feed or something like that that does let you do that. Or crossbow no, but the reload expert. The cross, crossbow just, expert. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but the reload property here is very specific because the war weapons say one shot. When you have the reload property, let's say it's it's like a rifle. Uh, you can reload when you spend three or four shots. But with this weapon, you give one shot, you need to reload. So we, a bonus action to reload, an yeah. action to yeah. shoot. Yeah. Right. Yeah, because I think it, 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 it's... Because crossbow doesn't have, you don't need to sacrifice a bonus action in the action economy. It just says you have a reload fun, you have a reload. Just, just making sure yeah, they, knows they, that, right? They, that means they, 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 they consider it the, the between shots you're reloading. Yeah. But that doesn't matter to you anyway, you're... Mikey, because you're, you're never going to get two shots because you're not Marshall. Yeah. Ah, true. We'll have, so it's proficient with martial weapons and have this mechanical uh, yeah. mechanical part. <coughs> so right now Hedge has that. He knows he's he knows how it works. He can show somebody else how it works that also has a martial proficiency, right? Yes. So, yes. Um, I could take it, although it's it's not that much better than my bow and. and general sense, but I only get one attack anyway, so hold on a sec. Durithil wouldn't take it because Durithil is all about the sword, I think. Itself. Yes, it's greedy. Durithil knows. Greedy. Sorry, I'm going to turn my camera off so you don't watch me eat. So oh. but we could take more of these weapons. Dallin's all about helping this guy out, and, and so I've been loading things up. We could take more of these weapons if we got some pack animals. I could make that happen. But I'm, I don't I don't know that walking down the street with a bunch of horses is a good idea. How I don't long, think we're going to find any the, horses. How long would the horses be here? Um, well, what is the... Oh, oh! You can call steeds. Is that it? <laughs> yeah. What's the? Okay. Up to an hour. Mm -hmm. how, how much? How long does it take us? How far is this? This all from here? Earth will know, right? Or... How would? Okay. Would so know? that. Well, what? I don't know. I mean, can I Why guess how, how far how far away Helm's shield hole is from where we are? Uh, as he said, you are walking. Oh, the priest, the priest can say, of course, you can ask the priest yeah. because remember, you are in this city. It's chaotic as fuck. Everything is yeah. burning. Everything. The city is kind of. You guess that the city is floating in the middle of the hell. So, you are walking more or less. You have a brief notion where you are. No. Uh, you don't have anyone that is native to Eltro here. You probably one of people that travel once or two here. Uh, so the you are the, <coughs> is the guy who can tell you more precisely where you can go, right? So that's yeah. that's the situation. Now you're in the basement, mm -hmm. knowing that devils are coming to re uh, arrive at any moment. What By the way, Hententa is upstairs at the at the hatch. Keeping yes. Ear, keeping an ear out for anybody coming in there. Just, just, just a question. How do, stuff we, to how do we know that um, the, the the devils are coming? I mean, do we are we just assuming we're going to be attacked, or we have some no, other no, information? No, no, no. Less you can you can so say anything it, yeah. how you discovered. Yes. So uh, last session, um, Leslie. Uh, tried to kill the archer in the, the group, right? I mean, him came to blows downstairs in uh, one of the mm -hmm. rooms, in this room over here. And, uh... Okay. 
So then after the fight was done, they surrendered. I took my rope of entanglement and I, I restrained him. And then I became him and I exited the room as him. And I said mm. that I killed the, the rogue. So uh, when I was mingling with them, um, the guy said, just try to survive. We have backup coming. There's devils coming. Uh, mm. So we have to go. Okay. 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 So these Can guys were in cahoots them. with the. Don't carry so these stuff. guys were in cahoots with the devils. They were trying to get these weapons. Mm -hmm. Right? Is that it? Yes. Yeah. That's why okay. they okay. basically okay. dragging you inside because they know that devils were coming. So that's why. Remember that you said they are stupid if they try to just uh, betray yes. us. But yeah, yeah, kill us. But what happens is that they are expecting backup. So yeah. Okay. You figured out that. That's why they were so eager to attract you inside of the tavern. Mm -hmm. I see, I see. Okay. Understood. So that's the situation. Now you are here and you have this request from this priest who is injured and desperate and frightened as fuck. And you, I, I, what are you going to do? So that extra potion, I'm just going to put it on my sheet then. Unless somebody needs it. Speak now. Mm -hmm. So everybody's getting uh -huh. out from the basement as far as I'm presuming that? Mm -hmm. um. You saw, uh, uh, when they, another thing that you saw so, uh, 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 a frustration uh, reaction in Romy when they, she discovered that Lassie was alive. So she's kind of, ah. Uh, <laughs> Fuck. Was too good enough that this bastard would. The reality that this bastard killed that fucker, but well. Better deals than nothing. Um, before we continue, this this broken sword that was in the box uh -huh. <clears throat> that we found, yes, mm -hmm. um. Did. The priest, that, I, was there any other information about it? Did the priest know anything about it? Did any of us try to identify it? Was there anything oh. we can, identifying symbols? I don't, because I missed this part. The it was priest, just like, no, no, that, that's Antar's, you can't have that. But we're bringing it to him, presumably. Yes. If you, if Wait, you decide to. Okay, Antar okay, okay. Froome okay. is a guy that the priest told you that is the we owner to to. of the place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I'm going to tell you something also. Uh, I'll win. You know who is Altar Fuel because he's a very <laughs> famous member of the Order of the Gauntlet. <laughs> is a kind of uh, his actions, his his history as a as a paladin of Torm. You know that he's a paladin, and he's a paladin <laughs> of I believe that is Torm. Uh, you know his fame. At least I will know his fame. So you know that he's. <laughs> Okay. He's a, 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 almost a celebrity among the uh, members of the Order of the Galaxy. Has the priest told us how many survivors there are over in the uh, shield hall? He has no clue because he basically run when the city was destroyed. He run mm -hmm. to the he, to the to the tavern, and he stays there for all the all the period. And another thing that he told you is that the because remember you know that to reach the the high hall you need to pass through uh, a bridge or two bridges mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. and they t he told you that these bridges were under the protection of uh, uh, being guarded by devils mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so he told uh, he, he just he'd known that and then he run it to the to the tavern, and then he stays there, expecting someone to save them, but wasn't what expect what happened. Okay, so so this the priest confirms what the half orc woman said about, or someone right? So she's the one who said the, the bridge was was being um, held by by devils. Yes. He, he yes. Works. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, excellent. Okay. So you walk it up, you reach the first floor, 
of the tavern. You were there, I believe, that running out of the tavern, right? No one's doing anything different from that. When you do that, but, you so hear. Oh, go on. I was just gonna say, let's let's hide that trap door, relock it, and hide it if we can. Okay, you go, and then unless he, because he went here, uh, Kai, you, this this is a basically a uh, a small hatch in the kitchen okay. from where you can reach the basement. Uh -huh. Okay, so are all the weapons and are we leaving the weapons in the basement? No, we are carrying a part of the weapons in the bag of holding. In the bag of holding, but not, okay, but there's a, there's another part of the, I just want to confirm, there's another bag uh, that is uh, still... Um, there's a bunch of I mean, weapons. Another bag, I mean, I mean, another portion of the weapons that we're leaving behind, is that correct? Yes, yes. yes. Okay. So I presume that you just put the weapons inside of the of the of the of the of the the, the chest, and then you put back the, the the you help the priest to close the the the, the hideout to, to the, the the hideout of his weapons to put the, 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 the because the, what happens? Did that, you want Konami uh, to animate the chest to go with us? Hmm. Is it a single like that? It, how many? There was like a bunch of lances in there. How big is this chest? Oh, you it's, see that the chest is is large. The, the, the lances are not very large lances. It's almost um, almost let's say um, what's the name the of the lances and halberds are are long instruments. Yeah, yeah they are. They are. They're long, but the chest was very large. He helped the the priest to bring the. The chest how long, over that. How long can you animate that chest? Uh, for an hour. And it hovers, um, so it can overcome obstacles. Um, it's not a bad idea if we think that's. It, it, it. Uh, it can move. Um. Oh, what is that? Yeah, it has like a 30 foot move speed minimum, right? A 30 foot floating speed, essentially. There you go. I mean, um. <clears throat> it, it can move as fast as any. It, it, it will move as, as fast as any of us. Can, can we can we can we get the, yeah. the, can we get this? Well, it can move this. as fast as me, definitely. <laughs> well, I mean, it's got a thirty foot move speed and moves faster than you. Um, can we can we get yeah. it through the hatch? Can, can we get this entire uh, crate slash chest through the hatch? I presume. Uh, they must have yes, it there. yes, yes. With the help of the people, but as it's going to be animate, it's a, it's the hatch is not small hatch; it's big enough to bring the. It'll chest. get itself through the hatch. Yeah. yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And if we have to abandon it, we still have a good portion of things in the bag. We we could if we have to abandon it, we could we get it. it. I mean, an hour further on. Yeah, it's good. Agreed. Hey, right. Leslie, before we walk outside, do we do we want to take a stealthy peek? Before anything, because that said, let me tell you first what gonna, what happens. Because you reach the, you, you bring, you animate the chest, you bring the chest, the precious floating with you. When you reach the first floor, you hear something heavy landing yeah. in the in the in the roof. Boom, and then we hear something heavy. Are there any windows on this main floor? You have a couple of windows, let's say. Um, you have a small window, you have a window here, and a window here. You can have some windows here and here. Mm -hmm. All right. So you can see through the windows; they are dirty, you know, full yep. of dirt. I'm gonna but go. You can, 
you can open it and you see that there are some bird devils God damn it. getting close to this area <clears throat> with a guy in and in front of them there is a guy with a cloak holding a an 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 a long bow, you know, and he's pointing and saying uh that in the, the tavern that probably you I don't know, they he's speaking with the, 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 the bird devils and the bird devils are looking around with the their halberds. Right. And then you wear they got wearing armor, you know, that that hellish armor that you found. And this heavy sound that you hear on the roof looks like that is also moving. So you boom boom. Even in the second, you can hear you he can hear that. Even staying in the first floor. Remember that this place has two floors, right? Mm -hmm. There is a second floor, so you can hear that something landed, even staying in the first floor. Okay, so there's there's definitely no back door. Um there, are there any windows in the back area here? Yes, yeah. there's windows here and yeah, those back. are windows. Yeah, those yes. are, those red boxes are windows, and yes? Yeah, 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 yeah. We're we're not making okay, a we're not making a run for it. I say we 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 hide and let them try and come in and we take them as they come in. I, I might be able to they draw them away. Them. Sorry? I might be able to draw them away. Um Perhaps. Depending on what they are, depending on what they are, um, actually, the, we have the two things: a bearded devil and whatever large thing is on top. Um, it might be better to draw them up onto the second floor because then um, we can. They have a. Uh, they're they're trapped in in the narrow corridor of the stairs. Just 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 wait here, and, and I'm gonna go outside, and then once they're away, you guys start making your way towards the middle of town and I'll, I'll follow you. I'm going to turn right. into the uh, the leader, Lucas. All right. Why is this happening? So the rest of the of you guys go to the second floor, right? I, I don't know. What do you... <clears throat> what are you going to do? I don't know. Uh, I, I, I say I think we should get to the second floor and hide. Okay. We, we should get out okay. and get Leslie to do his thing. Deception. Mm. It'll be easier if, if we're upstairs. Okay. Quiet now. Quiet. Whatever's, so up, whatever's on the roof is listening. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna okay, so move to the second floor. <laughs> as best as I can. Okay, so while you're moving to the second floor, you see Lazzy getting out. And uh, this guy said he cast his disguise self, and he's here in the first floor. Ugh, terrible fucking stealth, Jesus fucking Christ! <sighs> I'd say that I'm going to give you, I'm going, I'm going to give you advantage in the stealth because you are inside of the of the tavern, and the place is difficult to see, right? So it's it's going to be very difficult for them to to see you. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah. But while you're there hiding, play uh, casting your your stealth checks. As you are outside and you see this bunch of bird devils reaching, and this guy in front walking and saying, "Hey, boss, I got it. I brought back up. As you said, I found this." patrolling devils around here. Good. Send them over there. And then, but, sent where? You, it looks like that you, you finished this guy's law. Let, let's get the weapons. There's no weapons here. And then you see moving from the, you look up, uh, uh, and then you see coming out from the, the, the roof, but still looking at the roof, but you see what is in the roof. You see a very large creature. Looks like a, a, 
uh, an insectoid mm. creature with this very light, but it looks with some uh, bones covering his body, holding this, wearing this armor, and saying, Shh, mortal. Shut up. You were being attacked by devils, by demons. You killed them all. Is there any other gnome or demon around this place? Yeah, like ten blocks that way. There was a whole army of them. And then you see that a very large creature moving from the, the roof to the floor. Boom! When it hits the floor and then looks to you say, Ten blocks to where? Southeast. <clears throat> and what are the orders? The, your group, where is it? I'm afraid most of my group died. <clears throat> Road deception. looks to you see that you're kind of nervous gets close to you and hold you by the neck you are lying mortal well, one of them might be alive but they're not here anymore where is it where is the rest of the group and then he puts the hand on you he feels that is kind of something's not right, and then he starts to pay attention oh. and seeing this one is under that disguise. Enter quickly. They are hiding really? people. Let's really? kill them all. Remember the orders that we have. We must kill all the demons and all the adventures in the city. Anyone who can stop Zariel, go! And then roll initiative. Are we all aware of any of this happening? You hear this when he screams loud. You are lying, he screams loud. Okay. So you know what the f exactly what is happening. So roll initiative. Uh... We need to click on tokens to do that. Yeah. All right. So let's first you go up. We're all upstairs. So we got to get our tokens in the right spot. All right. <coughs> so yeah, we're on the step. We're on the second floor, technically, right? Yeah. Like yeah, everybody's yeah, on the yeah. second floor, right? Yeah. So let's say you are on the second floor. Let's let's start with those one who are going to start. Uh, Lizzie did roll. Lizzie. Yeah, he rolled a. Yeah. A, a, I'm a ten. Oh, I'm a ten. So let me go. Wow, it's a really low initiative, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, let me see.
Okay, so what's happened is Talon, you are the you heard the demon screaming and I'm gonna tell you you have windows here 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 and here so have a from where you are you can see from a window if you get close to it and try to see what is happening So is that window clear enough I, I can see out of it? You can see, you can see, you can see from, from the window the de the devil holding Lazzy's neck. Can I uh, push it open and take a shot? Yes, you can. All right. I'm going to shoot the bone devil. Oh, wow. Sharp Sharp shot, silver arrow plus one. Well, you shot and reach just the floor. You attract the attention of the bone devil. Yeah. And then uh, yes. I will back away from the window. All right. Outside. You have the bone devil right here. He holds. Bless his neck. And then you see. Yes, we did take a short rest, yeah? Uh, well, we were no. downstairs? No? No. We did. No? Okay. No, you didn't have time, you know. You were you were uh, running to, to try to flee mm -hmm. from the devil. Uh. So, let's say this bone devil goes and attack you with a claw. Miss. Miss. Uh... Yeah. I'm gonna shield that. Alright, go on. And then he moves you and then you dodge the first attack. The second one you roll the shield and bam and you stop it. And then he goes and you see that his his tail is attacking you from below from 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 under. From above, <laughs> miss. All oh, right, it's a shield. Yes. So we, again, you stop it. Bam! And ah, and then he screams to the devils and this archer also to attack you. All right. The archer goes and see that. There is people on uh, on the second floor, so he points and just stays uh, uh, aiming to the to the windows. <coughs> so you see that he's just prepared. If anyone appears, he, he's gonna attack. So the bird of devils goes here and starts to run. They are trying to reach the... This one is going to try to push you, Lazzy. So it's a contest, a strength contest. <laughs> Athletics. Oh, sorry, I rolled wrong. But he fails anyway. It's just a two in the dice. He's trying to push you. So you're basically there, shoot open. The, the bone devil is attacking you, you raise your shield, now this guy tries to push you, you dodge us and then but you keep your position. They are trying to reach this place. This one is going to do an athletics check. He's trying to climb but he fails, but he's you definitely realize that he's trying to climb the the tavern. I'll win. Okay. Um, bonus. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. No. Yeah, no. All right. Uh, bonus action, Wrath of the Moon. 
and then I'm going to go running down the stairs. So I'm going okay. to take a dash action down the stairs, try and get into the front door. Did okay. you want to draw them up here? But that's why um, we came up here. Well, I mean, I got to get toward this. I mean, they're, they're already coming, right? Yeah. Yes. So, they are trying yeah, to I pass mean, through the main entrance, but Les is holding them. So right, do, what you, do what you do. We, we can still draw them up here. The thing is that they're going to kill Leslie, right? Like, so I, I'm, I'm so just, you know, metagaming wise, I'm not just going to run. Uh, how far can I get? Let's say it's 30 feet. Uh, Kai, can I, can I make a suggestion to you? Uh, yeah. So Durathil is a non-human entity, right? Yep. He has no fear. He doesn't know what it is to live or, 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 or regret mistakes. You know what I mean? Sure. So yeah, maybe just... he would jump out the window and, and attack from above? I'm just... Cinematically jump in and say, ah, you know, all this stuff. Yes, it's a possibility you're going to probably <laughs> get injured, but... If I, I would allow you to do an acrobatics to see if you can do a superhero <laughs> landing or something like that. Dorothil must realize that Owen's body is gimpish and fucking, <laughs> <laughs> fucking undexterous, right? And um, he definitely doesn't have a leg. Just the moment. Yeah, that. I mean, my my dexterity is oh, fucking horrendous, right? Like I know, I know that sounds cool. Uh, but I don't. I, this is a good question. I mean, Dorothil doesn't care about surviving the you know the body much, but I do. Oh, doesn't care about it. He, he, he cares. The Dorothil realize that needs the body. Uh, <laughs> he's, yeah, he needs the body. Dexterity negative one. <laughs> that's he's not that's going the to kill problem. himself. <laughs> I would okay. probably the the most likely thing is I would just impale myself on my own sword. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm not confident in acrobatics yet. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not, you know, Especially. suggesting that you guys throw yourself out the window to save me. I'm, I'm fully capable <laughs> of saving myself. I'm just saying that I, I think it would be cool if, if Durathil threw himself out the window and started hacking yeah. shit up. I, I think that Frederick would do that. He's, yeah. It's, it's because he died before, so for him is. It's kind of yeah. Uh, I mean, D Durathil is running like fearlessly into the midst of battle. I mean, he's going to face the Bone Devil, but you know, I think he's just. I, don't, I just don't, don't think he'd be. I think he knows the limits of of of, uh, of Dur of uh, Owen's shitty body. <laughs> so, would I be able to get through? You know, let's say you need you need no, not not definitely. You no, okay. just reach the star the stairs next to Bard. You can walk. Uh, from the, the entrance, I would give you more 20 feet, more or less. I mean, yeah, because I mean, I'm gonna dash. I mean, I'm just gonna, yeah, gonna even run. dash because let's say it's 20 feet, it's 20 feet from upstairs. So, how much you you can reach? Okay, so where, where would I be? Where's the front door? Exactly here. Oh, uh, the, 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 this map is the front door on top here, right? This, yep, the, the front door to get out is here. Yeah, so okay, so then how far do I get towards the front door? Running from the second floor to the front door. As I said, you tell me you were here, or over you, you were here, and then you're gonna, yeah. you can walk uh, 15 feet, right? I don't know. No, I mean, my, no, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a move action and a dash action. And, okay, and dash use my action. bonus action to ignite, okay. that's what I mean, like, I'm running full speed. But you Kyle, know, on your, on your, um, on your sheet, it says you only have 15 feet of movement. So what? even if yeah. even what? if you dead, well, uh, Yuri Wait, Yuri that, pointed that, it out. That, that, I don't know if that's something no, that you did that, that to right. gimp yourself, like because you only have one leg. No, I think I had an affliction at some point where my where it halved my speed. That that's I don't have any afflictions anymore, so that's not correct. Okay, I have a so normal let's thirty say, foot move. Okay, so I, see, I would I allow you. Okay, I, I I see. But just for for this for this round, you can reach right here. Yeah, you put me, you know, where I where I can be, but yeah, I, you I, stay. I did a move yeah, action yeah. and a dash action. Yeah, yeah that we did a dash right. action, we can reach here. Fine, okay, and that should be 60 feet. Yeah, okay. Yes, yes, yes. I'll move it. No problem. Right, and I ignite okay, through it. Here. Um, okay. And I start making noise, like I start screaming in ancient elven. Um, right. And then I start, and not only in ancient elven, then I'm going to scream, because I don't know Abyssal, but I do know Infernal. Um, and so... 
the um, plan the plan would I'm have sorry. failed anyway because all the civilians plus Romy are downstairs anyway, right? They would have just oh, killed yeah. them. We, we, they never got what placed is down the here? Should, shouldn't they be upstairs too? They're supposed to be upstairs. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay, so they are basically around here. Yeah, they should all be hiding upstairs with us. Um, yeah, they're not okay, supposed to be there. Romy's here. Okay, all right. Yeah. So you're the only one not there. So. In a, in, a, in a sense, I'm making noise and drawing them towards me, right? I'm trying to get their attention. All right. right? So. Uh, Les, it's your turn. Does he still have me by the neck, Lucas? Uh, no, you're not grappled because he tried to attack you. Okay. I'm going to... I'm going to disengage and I'm going to enter the building. Okay, so you disengage, you go enter the building. Uh, I'm so going to happen. I'm going to jump behind the bar and I'm going to use my bonus action to hide. Okay, so you can move. And I'm gonna hide, and that's my uh, that's my turn. Oh right, so it's Romy turns. Romy just go is going to use oh. her. She's going to use her action. Transform herself into a into her succubus form, and say, "Damn it!" Let me go again, save your fucking skins, and then she goes and she jumps. But she's not jumping, she basically flies out. Break the window and then just fly. Full speed outside. So you can see that she's now around. Around here. No, not here. Uh. She's flying, let's say. Uh, 20 feet. And then when she flies out, you just hear the, the bone devil screaming in the inferno. Demons! Kill them all! We're under attack! We must kill them all! Did she trigger that held action? Yes, that triggered the fucking held action because the uh, archer is going to shoot against her and it's at her, let's say, at her leg. She feels almost nothing because the arrow just hits and falls to the to the floor. But why this is happening? It's Antenta's turn. What's Antenta's gonna do? Antenta is going to uh, run down the stairs after Owl. All right. So, uh, he's going to do twenty feet for upstairs. So. For your calculations, everybody. Just remember that. Thirty. So I'm good. here at so fifty to here. Sixty. It's gonna get it over here. Wait for somebody to come through that door. Right. The priest, in desperation, just hides himself inside of this room. Frederick is here. Uh, okay. I run towards the window. His head is out. And I try to find Laz outside. I just look. And you realize that Les is not there anymore. Hmm. Okay. 
I... <coughs> I'm gonna be creative and use Chi Attach in <laughs> anyone that got hit already. No one, no one. Did you touch? And then move my feet back, and that's my turn. <coughs> so you attack. You gonna say you can? Uh, which one of these devils you you gonna attack? I don't think I hit anyone. It's a, it's a uh, nine to hit. Okay, so it's definitely just just shot desperation. <laughs> It just, just shot out the window, I'm not even looking at it. <laughs> I didn't shot him in the window, I shot the window. Lucas's impression of Frederick was fucking awesome. <laughs> no! No! Oh, uh, go away! Go away! <laughs> It was like a, a, it reminds me of a fat woman swatting a bee. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, you know me it's you. You just hear the 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 very noisy attack of Frederick and disappointing attack of Frederick uh, what are you gonna do? sorry about that um, all I think I can do is move towards the windows because I'm my legs are so tiny um, so, so that's it really I'm just coming on, on in my way Oh, I could get. I could do a bit of bardic inspiration, though, couldn't I? Who's? Uh, let me have a look. Who, who's coming up in the? T okay, I'll, I'll give a um, a bardic inspiration to Talon. Good. So notes here. You have a bardic inspiration. All right. So you hear just the girl just starts to move fast and stays right behind Alwyn. Uh, does Hedge get to play today or? Oh, no, no, no. He's okay. not gonna play today, but you you can play for him, but uh, he wanted us that he, he needs to. He's traveling with his happy role for him. No, but do we, I, do we want him in combat or not? not the yeah, it's just for it's, you decide. It's, I roll initiative for him. All right. You can play. You can play his. You can play his turn. Somebody want to do it? It's up to you. You volunteered him, John. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's up here. Yeah. So he's going to. What's his movement? I got it. Oh, gee. 25. 25. So, I'm just gonna... Actually, he's moving sturdy because he's got the boots of spot striding and spring. Okay, so it's 30. And another... 30 gets him to the top of the stairs. Outside, hold on. It's him essentially here. All right. So he is using the same space of or, yeah of, of Lus. Yes. So what happens that in this in this time ha Harkina just runs um, and basically jumps, goes out. Wait a minute. She goes here and jumps, staying right here, preparing herself. To anyone who would enter this area, Talon is you again. Everybody's a bunch of people is downstairs. Gnomi is just behind. Uh, you are with Frederick, like in a, a sniper, you know, position. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to uh, use the pop up and uh, shoot outside, and I will shoot for uh, 
Who can I Which see? One? Um, I will shoot at the Bone Devil again, but this time uh, just a regular shot, regular silver arrow. Mm. Hold on. You miss. Again? God. Yes. Yeah. The Bone Devil basically dodges. And I uh, will back up. Okay, so you go back up. Man, I'm rolling shit. All right. <coughs> uh, you hear the bone devil move. Like a beast. He basically... Fit, the, the main door, the front door was uh, destroyed, but now he's destroying even a part of the wall when he enters. So imagine that thing, that scene of this large and horrifying creature just invading the, the tavern. Blah! It goes and breaks the main entrance when he, he enters the tavern. He goes and blah, go and destroy the, the main entrance. Seeing a bunch of people inside, he just goes in direction of, uh, let's say, he goes in direction of Harkina. And first he attack Hententa with his claw. 16. Uh, misses, no, that missed. missed. Oh yes, second claw attack. Misses. What, why Misses. is happening this hard? Oh, sorry, what's happening here? There's a charge you, attack? Charge attacks, but you rolled a know. seven and a I, ten. I don't know what happened. Uh, yeah, it's a seven. So sorry, it's the first attack. Is a charge, but it's appearing to charge attack. What the fuck? And Lucas, the uh. No, it does. It does. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. So it's just shoot claw attacks. And the third one is a 10 plus 5 is a 15. Yep. So the third one hits. Um, aim, uh, aims with the, the, the tail. He goes and tries to hit Hartina, who quickly dodges. So boom, boom, he's attacking the floor. He enters in a very violent way. Why does this happen? In? Mm -hmm. The archer. Also, this bone devil is not here. The archer also enters. Uh, and he immediately comes here and aims Owen two shots. Yep, okay. Oh. Um, well, yeah. Do a stress check for me because the two, the two, the two shots hits your chest, almost piercing your heart. <sighs> and he do the shots with two arrows with one like you know he grabbed two arrows and boom, shoot one two um, you misses wait, ignore ignore that because um yeah, I, uh, sorry yeah you take you you got uh, one point of stress and you okay. and in total is 24 points of damage yeah well that sucks. Yes. Okay. Yep. So, now you have this army of bird the devils also invading the bird the devils enter 
two, three, four. One of them reach here, the other one just goes and attacks Hantanta. The other one just goes here and close to Hantanta. And the other one just stays behind the, the bone battle, trying to reach the place. Why so, did this crazy lady come down here? She die. So the bird of devil uh, two attacks. One with the beard, misses, one with the glaive against Hantenta. 24 hits. So roll for me a constitutional saving throw for Hantenta. Passes, so it's just eight slashing. The other one. Again, bird. And glaive. Seventeen. Uh, Seventeen hits. Yeah. 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 So roll for me again another constitution saving throw. Woo! So what happens? That Tenta takes eight. Eight. So it's sixteen damage. Yep. All right. So that's the situation. They invade. They invaded this. This place. Now there is full of this large amount of devils attacking you inside of the tavern. Owen is you. Uh, yeah, all right, well, that's not really optimal, but uh, I'm gonna run downstairs uh, uh, using partial movement. Uh, I guess like, what, 10 feet of, uh, five feet of movement to get next to the bone devil. Uh, I'm gonna use my, bo um, do, 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 uh, use my bonus action to cast Shield of Faith. Okay, and that should uh, boost up my AC now to 24. All right. Uh, as I get a boost of Shield of Faith. <clears throat> as um, it sort of adds to the swirling blue, you know, spirit uh, <laughs> that uh, form a cloud around me. Um, and then I am going to try and um, stab uh, this uh, thing. Uh, with uh, Durathil. That's exactly what I'm going to do. And, um... Misses, the first one. Yeah, wow, fucking shit-tastic, huh? Um, okay. And then, uh, second attack. It's um, a hit. Okay, uh, nine four. Okay, uh, then with that, in that case, uh, then I'm going to, uh, on top of that, uh, take a, a divine smite uh, uh, with um, a uh, third level spell slot. All right. Good. So it's uh, right, 13, great. 28, 29, 40, 42, I believe. Okay, yeah, um, 30, um, it's uh, 32, 41. 41, okay. Yeah, yeah. So it's, it's a powerful hit against the creature. Yeah. It just go and blash, hits very strongly the arm of this spirit of devil, of this bone devil that screams loud, scaring even the other spirit of devils. And the head soul is mine. I see yes. in, right. in, um, in, in um, Infernal. <clears throat> so. And you see the bird of devil immediately looks to you as his main target now. Go. Now it's Hedge. What's Hedge gonna do? So Hedge is up here. Can he hop down the side yes. of the stairs? Or? Okay. Yes, yes, he can. So, because that's the scene, right? Everybody's getting out from the stairs and jumping, right? This is stairs like it's five feet high from the floor. So imagine this wooden stairs, five feet high, that yeah. allows you to reach the entrance. So it basically, everybody's jumping and go there. You see that a bout of devils entering, and it's Owen and Hemtenta and Harkina there, 
working as a shoot shoot wall, right? Attacking the devils. So he's gonna go around Harkina. He's gonna bonus cast shield or spirit shroud. Fourth spirit of the dead, which fits around until you spell hands and attack you make deals one d eight extra damage. Okay. Radiant. All right. And uh, attack with the spear. Does he have how many attacks? Does he have? Uh, does he have two attacks or just one? Features Lucky Bray, Hoffling, naturally attack the blade. I don't know. You got two. You got two. All right. Attack warrior. Four. Okay. Uh. 23 and uh, oh, he didn't Which do one it. He's attacking uh, this, this, this bearded devil. Here. Okay, okay, so just hits the just click the spear to see the damage. <coughs> Six, Six. all oh, right, and oops, plus four That's radiant. 2d8, John. He casts, or he casts every spell at 5th level. Uh, but he's attacking with his spear. No, he this is, is the, uh, but it's the from spell. The smite. He casts every spell at 4th level? 5th level. 5th le level. Okay, hold on a second. But that's probably, I think that's his last spell slot of the day. Because he, he, did can cast, he cast a spell earlier. He only gets 2 spell slots. Ah, yes. But he's got this for a minute, and so it's a 2d8. I mean, double check that. Well, uh, he casts a spell slot, a fourth level or higher. Okay, yeah. So, let me do it again. So. Yeah, that's another seven, 11 points radiant damage. Points. So okay, there's... so it's... You see that some kind of bright emanates from... Hatch... Spear that hits the creatures. All right. Are they, are they uh, particularly sensitive to radiant? You get to attack, uh, Sean. No. Sorry. No. Just hits them. Oh, it's a hit. Thanks. That's a fair amount of damage. All right, so he rolls. Okay, so he goes and keeps hitting it no, with the one. arrow. Yes. Spear. Concentration one minute. Okay, so he's concentrating now. All right, so he's keeping that hitting. So uh, the priest is there hiding. Frederick is you. you. You realize that there is no more devils. You hear that the devils invaded. Hey, hey, Lucas, you right? You went right from hedge. You skipped me and Hetenta. Oh fucking hell! All right. So, uh, why he jumped it? So it's Hedge, and what is you? You should be 10. I'm, I'm 10. To 10. Why, why are you not here in the turn order? Because, because he's out of the map. The, the turn order yeah. doesn't share maps. Yeah, uh, you have to move his, you have to move, um, like Anthony from the other map, like into, onto this oh, map. No, now I fix it. Okay, so yeah. it's, Laz is here. You want to oh, see the monsters too? What? Did you put the monsters too? Yeah, they all came. They they didn't get imported when they came out of this map. No, they yeah. are. I've, oh, the map. Yeah, they're not. Turn, turn order. Yeah, but I don't know why they're not here. The bird of devil. Let me see. Uh, the bird of devil are. Okay, so the, the, the Bone Devil is not here. I think the Archer was at 10. The Bone Devil was 
believe... He was 21, the Bone Devil. Uh, the Bone Devil was 21, and the Archer was... 10. Yes. But they basically disappeared from nothing. I don't know what. Okay. The Archer is 17. It's here. The Archer is here. Okay. So it's you now. Now it's everybody here. I think that Romy is not here also. Alright. I'm gonna... Romy was 10. Was... I'm gonna go behind this dude and stab him. I'm gonna bonus action shift my hunters, my hex to him. Okay. And then I'm going to uh, stab him. I'm hidden from him, right, Lucas? Wait a minute. Let me just put Romy here. <coughs> just put everybody here in the turn order. She was a 10. Okay, so uh, what what was the question? I was hidden from him, right? Yeah, so you are an unseen attacker. Okay. Oh, so attacker with, with advantage, yes. Oh man, Ooh. my bad. It shouldn't be yet. Does a 15 hit him? No. Alright, I miss. I'm going to uh, go back to where I was. I'm move that way. Uh, he can so take it out by attack. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So what happens is that. He's holding a, a, a bow, right? A bow, a bow. Yeah, yeah, so he's going to try to hit you with the bow, but with its advantage. Just a shot with its advantage, of course. Him misses. He tried to uh, shot you, and then you just dodges. My bonus <coughs> action, I'm gonna uh, hide. So stealth, okay, you, you're you hidden. That's my turn. Okay, so what has happened is that Bromi just enters here. Now she's not flying anymore. And she starts to shoot people with her. She shot first the Bone Devil with her Albert, Albert Blast. What? So it's a miss, and then she shots the this bird of devil right in front of her, and she also misses. So she misses both attacks. Intent is you. <coughs> Intent is uh, which which enemies are engaged? So the one there's one with engaged with hedge, and the this bone devil are, is engaged with um, is engaged with Alwyn now. Oh, right. Um, he will attack the Bone Devil. Go on. Uh, okay. That oh. is a failure. When he tries to attack the Bone Devil, immediately the Bone Devil goes and hits him with his, his stink that is in his tail. Is it 22? Yeah. Oof. Uh, roll for me, uh... Oh, he's fucking down. Alright, but the point is that... When he tries to jump... You see the scene. The Hentet is gonna jump and immediately the Bone Devil... Almost uh, impale him with his, his tail. Smash! He falls limp. And then he throws the 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 the, the hand tent at, at the wall. Blah! And then it even looks to our and see no more distractions. And, and goes you see that he's he's heading towards um Owen. And the priest is hidden, crying. Frederick, now it's you. Can you see everybody there? Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay, I am <coughs> move. 30 feet. And I'm 
going to dash. I'm gonna take okay. the stairs, but not get down them. I'm going to get mm -hmm. this part uh, equivalent in the, other, in the other map, but it's still on the upper floor. Like, if I could just, in the next, uh, in the next movement, I could just pick mm -hmm. the other side and then come back. Would that work if I put my token in that place or want me to be? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's square. there. So let's just, let's just consider okay. that you are. But I still That's cover, right? Yeah, you still cover. So you're, you're <coughs> getting down. You, you let's so let's say you you need to walk more ten feet to reach the the door and open it, make a peek, and then whoop, you close it. Okay, okay, perfect for me. That's my turn. All right, uh, Gnome is you. You are alone with Talon in the second floor and listen the very powerful battle, destructive battle in the first floor. You're muted. Mike, you're muted. Muted. No. <laughs> um. And um, the animated chest that we brought up to the first floor, but left on the first floor. Um. Under word. Where do, where do you think we left it, Lucas? So, around, around, I don't know, around here? Yeah, it's just, let's say that, I don't know if you must be close to the chest <laughs> every single time. Ah, because there's a bonus action, I can get it to do stuff there. But, uh, do I have to be within 30 feet of it? I'm not sure. But remember, yeah. it has hit points, and if it gets attacked, it's going to break. I'm going to say that this thing has around 15 hit points. Mm hmm You know, it's not indestructible. Yeah, so I guess we didn't take it upstairs. We just kind of left it there. Now. So um, from where I am, the top of the stairs. I guess I don't have a clear view of anyone at the moment, do I? No, no, no. No. Okay, so so that's me for now. So we're gonna just stay in the second floor with the chest. Well, did, did we not leave the chest uh, downstairs? Uh, as far as I see, you you, uh, you can animate one large uh, within thirty feet. Okay, but. Uh, did did we I animate? Did you animate it, Mike, before we left the building, though? Yeah. So presumably, no, I, we, I would have taken it up the second floor with me, then, wouldn't I? Yeah. Yeah. So Possibly. that's. Like, but but, so, but oh, it, it's see, it's so, it's at a time limit, uh, right? Yeah, you only yeah, have an yeah. hour. So why would you so, so cast it on there to hide it somewhere for like five minutes? You know what I mean? No, what I mean is that if I can get it to do something, can I get the chest to open itself and fling things at the? Uh, no, at because the you don't. Have, you only animate. You only animate the chest, not the weapons inside. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But but no, but the, but the, the chest. I was going to run the bush and go. Yeah. You, it, basically, what it's going to do is like uh, throw the the uh, the chest. I don't know. Like. Uh, like a battering ram, something like that. Blah, right. something like that. But remember but that the chest, and as 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 Kai said, it it can break. Yeah. So the chest is just gonna follow me around, basically, then, isn't it? <coughs> yeah, like a dog. You have yeah, to yeah. put in the second here. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, yeah. No, I'm gonna have to wait until my next move to get to get sight of anyone then. But the chest uh, doesn't need to be close to, as far as I, as I read, in the... No? No, no. Just for animated, it must be within 30 feet of you, but not necessarily must be close uh, to you. But okay. let's say that the chest is, okay, so is now... Let's, it's... let's leave it there, then. Yeah. Yeah, let's leave the chest there, then. I think, I think the chest can dodge by itself, but I think anything else 
I need to use a bonus action to get it to... Yeah, the chest is following you as a dog. That's that's the reality. Uh, okay. okay. Yeah. 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 So you I have, just uh, have my... I'll this have is, my, like, hand crossbow at the ready. You had you had Woody, now you have a chesty. Chesty is your <laughs> friend. Chesty? Mm. These yeah, all chesty. sound like... Uh, are you are you guys familiar with the Carry On films? <laughs> no. Ah, they're like porn names. Yeah. Chesty yeah. and Woody. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Booby. <laughs> Booty and Chesty. The three companions of Gnome. Okay, let's... Oh gosh, this is getting worse. Uh, so what are you going to do? No, I think... Uh, I think that's my action, is just to move to the... Uh, move, it's a movement. You're gonna yeah, move. Just, you can do a dash I, action to try to reach your. Oh friends. yes, I can. Yeah, but then I, and I can't. Um, if I dash, I can't do another action, can I? I'm getting out. No, no. A, a dash is an action. Yeah. So no, I'm gonna stay there because then I don't want to leave myself vulnerable to uh, attack. I'll take my action on on the next row. Okay, so you're gonna and do you're gonna do what Kinobi does best. That is hide, as far as I as I at the top of the yeah, You could you, you could use your action to hide then, Mike. If you're not gonna use your action to dash. Yeah. Yeah. Just hide. I'm, I'm, I'm or you could take you could take the dodge I'm, action. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm then you're right. One has got a task. So okay, so you're gonna do. Uh, you're gonna walk. I'm hiding behind Frederick, am I? Am I hiding no, you, behind? No, you, you you are far from Frederick. Let's say that you're gonna stay where, exactly where you are, and you're, you're gonna yeah. do the dodge action to try to protect yourself. Basically, while walking, uh, put your hands in front of of your, of your head, with, yeah. with your animated chest following you as a dog, yeah. and then yeah, you're, maybe maybe even in a fetal position. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fetal position, like yes. Yeah, yeah. Doing, doing what uh, uh, Gnomi does best. So what happens that oh, no. this yeah. come here, and then you realize that she goes behind you, Owen. Okay. And she put her hand. And while you're fighting, she put her hand on on your back, and she casts Q rounds. So you well. see that she will, she heals you seven points. All right. Well, so uh, yes, this strange, mysterious girl is basic, basically protecting you. Interesting. Mm-hmm. And her kina is there like a half orc, strange creature, Breaking. and Rah! die, fucking bastards! And she holding her long sword with two hands, attacking the bird, the bird of devils, and failing miserably. Okay, so what's happened is that Talon is you. Okay. Uh, I'm going to move. And then I'm going to bonus action dash. That'll get me to well, twenty feet to reach the floor, so uh, you can you can open you can be right Yeah yeah. So you jump in Boom. And I'm going to uh, shoot that fucking bone devil and try and hit it this time. So what's happened is that cinematically you just jump from the uh, through the, the door and throw in Throwing arrows, you shot the per you shot the arrow and it misses. Yep. Hits hits the, the, the armor that he's using, right? You see that this creature is wearing some kind of black iron armor, right? So hits the, the, the creature exactly in the armor, but the arrow just starts spinning in the in the air. <laughs> And the, the bone devil is there. Wait a minute, you just me fixed. Okay. So the bone devil is dead and raw and 
claw attack against Owen. Misses. Nope. Attack nope. you with anger and fury. Mm -hmm. You're dodging. You see that he hits the, the, the stairs, breaking the stairs, splash, and then the second one, splash, and then the, this thing goes and you basically raise your sh uh, your shoot of faith and hits the shoot of faith. It's not strong enough to pierce it. Bam! And then you go, Rah! scream with anger. The archer. Oh, wait a minute. Why are you doing that to me? No, 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 no. This guy here. It's this guy that I want you to. Wait a minute. So. Wait. Yes. And then I delete this one. Okay. So this archer goes here, and there is a bunch of people covering the entrance. So he sees that someone is trying to 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 throw arrows. So he's trying to he's gonna try to hit a uh, talon, but I'm going to grant a talon a plus two cover because of the amount of people blocking the, the vision between. Because that's the this very chaotic fight in the middle of this tavern. So he's gonna shot wife with the longbow shot okay. fails and fails yes. boom, boom. it hits the wall now the bird of devils wait a minute son of a bitch son of a bitch uh come on tracker Trav. okay thank you and this one is the victim. okay. So the bird that this one is going to attack Hedge. Beard, all the same. Glaive. Uh, both of them misses. The second one, the same thing. Beard. This one is attacking uh, Harkina. The first attack hits pierces her and she's gonna do a constitution saving throw she passed this so she's not poisoned but the glaive goes here 22 oh slashing and she must do a... um uh, uh, yeah it's she why yeah well, i don't know why this thing is happening it's the fucking glaive uh she must do a constitution saving throw like, and she does yeah. she does get a plus two on the con save because she's in my 10 feet of me which means the uh, aura protection okay so she's gonna do another one so is a plus is 14 so she passes so okay. she's been there, been cutted by the 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 the, 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 the tentacles that goes out from the creature's uh, face, hits her, and she feel that that kind of acid or something hits her in the face, and then the glaive go cuts her in the in the belly. She it's not that deep, but enough to bleed her. She's there, very destructful fight. This one is gonna ten feet, ten twenty. 30 it's 30 feet here so he's basically Bitch. going in the passing through the bone devil with a, 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 a some kind of difficulty and going towards he's going to do a dash action here and gets close to talon and this one is going to do 10, 20 30 dash action and then is going to stay right here Trying to, to. Hey, hey, Lucas! I, I'm, I don't want to try to meta game you, but you can't pass through enemy um, units. Oh yeah, he's passing through. Okay, so yeah, this is true. It's true. I forgot that Hedge is there. So yeah, he's yeah. gonna do. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. I forgot that. Definitely. So he's there. He's gonna he stay behind this one, right? I mean, technically, yeah. he, could, he could go like this. But that, you know, as soon as he no, passes no, no. the Yeah, but it's true. He saw Romy. Romy is there. And what's going to do is go here and attack Romy. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. 
and then he's gonna come here bird oh it's a hit and saving throw con she fails so she's poisoned and she takes it's not not that strong and then the glaive she, he misses ah she's here she's screaming how it is you okay um yeah i got to shoot the faith up concentration i have um oh yes and they all succeed let me say you succeed the concentration rules right or because you were well, no no you're, no no he fails he fails he fails he fail. go, go on go on go on and, 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 it'll, and, and if anything happens, it'll do it automatically anyway. Um, so okay, okay, go on, go on. It, it go doesn't on. matter. Um, I just wanted to confirm something real quick here. Yeah, no. All right, so, um, you know, Owen is going to, um, you know, yell at this thing in Inferno that it will die here if it does not leave. And I am going to drink its soul and consume it for all eternity. Um, and which he's yeah. going to... You gotta hit it first. Yeah. Uh, what happened there? Come on. The fuck? Uh, something's wrong with my thing. Okay, hold up. Hit him. Fucking God's sakes. Okay, all right. Um, so, 16. Okay, so I miss on that one, but in, uh, I am going to use one of my uh, divine... Um, my channel divinities. Uh, and then, because uh, I know what I need to hit this, and I am going to use... Guided Strike. Uh, which could make that a a, a 26. Oh, you know what? Fuck. Um, I should have had um, <laughs> Wrath of the Moon on that, so I'm just gonna add another 3d6 of damage on top of that. Mm -hmm. uh, because I assume uh, with roll. a 26 will hit, right? Since yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, of course, yeah, yes, roll, okay. Roll the 3d6. Okay, so that's a, a 13, so that's 21 points of damage. Uh, and with All that right. case, when I hit, I'm going to do another third level Divine Smite on it. Roll one. Smite that fucker. Okay, for 24 points. Yeah. Uh, it, it should be rage. 5d8. Oh. Oh. Uh, yeah, so it should be another one because it's an undead. Yeah, I need to put that on there. Um, yep, so I'm going to do another D8 on there. You're right, Anthony. I forgot to uh, put that that little thing there. I should have done, done, done that. Actually, technically, technically it sh I should have done that before because uh, I didn't I didn't include that. So actually, I'm going to roll another D8 because I should have been the damage from last time. So that's an additional uh, nine points of damage. Woo! So 8, 24. Uh, so that's uh, 32. That's another 41 points of damage to it. Okay, so you go and flash ah, the sword is the creature is ah. uh, and the the, the blue the, the blue flame of Durathil is starting to sort of wrap around it as you know that's, I, I stab it in, um, in you know in between whatever it's kind of weird bony carapace and the blue the sword starts to close blue it's already starting to sort of cons try and consume its soul uh, and then I use my second uh, Durathil uh, attack let's make sure that I have this I have all the stuff clicked on correctly uh, Wrath of the Moon but nothing else yes okay and um, Okay, I miss with that one. Um, you know what? Uh, I am going to use my second divine. Uh, you only um, have one. You only have one channel divinity, Kai. What? Yeah, I think it's it, it, but, per day? But, but but see, you get one from your your paladin. You get one from your priest, but they don't stack, so you only get one. Oh, oh come the fuck on! Oh. Jesus Man, you, fucking you, Christ! You, Seriously? You did, yeah. you did, but you did amount of damage. Ah, oh, it's fucking shitastic. Okay, um, I always thought I had two of them. Um, oh, it's the same. It's, it's in the same vein as in if you were a fifth level barbarian and a fifth level paladin, you don't get three attacks. You still only get two attacks, even though you have um, multi attack twice. You know. When do I when when do I get two channel divinities then? Whenever you get a second you... one from either your paladin or your cleric. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay. 
I could have sworn. Because it's, oh, it's anyway. more classy. He has your right to it. Yeah, classy. yeah, yeah. No, I, 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 well, it doesn't matter. Fuck it. I, I, I sworn I already had two of them, but whatever. Paladin. No. Um... That's the problem with boot classing. Sometimes you think that things are stacked and they don't stack. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. It, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, so I miss on my on my second attack, uh, but then I am going to use um, my. Um, I just want to confirm that I, I put it. I'm going to use bolt of inspiration, uh, which is going to give me a third attack as a bonus action. I haven't used any bonus actions yet for anything, and so then I'm going to do that, and Wait. then I'm going to do another attack with Dorothil. And that one hits yes. uh, for 23 points, and then I'm going to use, once again, then my last third level spell slot, and I'm going to Divine Smite this motherfucker, uh, and I'm going to make sure that I, I put uh, Divine Smite on Den Fiend. Let me just shift that real quick, and then uh, the correct Divine Smite as I... Uh, another 20 Why? points, so that's uh, 20, uh, 23 and uh, 43 points of damage. Okay, so what's happened is that you come so you, you, you become so enraged and with you, your eyes are going ex absurdly blue and the flames are always putting control of your body. So like an avatar of destruction and starts to slash the creature, you even take out some parts of the bone that surrounds this beast and then he's screaming and loud and, and then in desperation you even see the bird of devils uh absolutely kind of getting frightened of that right but they, they you just they just hear the bone that say keep going for sorry and then keep screaming it but you realize that this bone devil is almost dying right and but it gets enraged and keep pushing forward, but it's you almost kill it with your last strike, right? So now Hedge is you. You see that this brother devils are kind of shaking, but still fighting. Okay. What Hedge is gonna do? <laughs> but the brother, the bone devil is very close to die. All right. What Hedge is going to do? Hedge is going to attack the one right in front of him with the spear. What? Uh, misses. What the fuck is this info? Do it again. Hits. That hits. And for 8 plus 19. It is still using. I add this. Do we, okay, so you go and. It, kill it should this. only be 2DA, John. I thought you said it was 3d8. No, 2d8. Ah, okay, sorry. Uh, but it's it's, two, it's it's eight plus eight, eight five. five, eight five. Oh, so it's still enough to kill it. Okay. It's still enough to kill it. So we'll go and cut the head out of this um. fucker. And less is you. Okay, I'm gonna try to go behind this dude and fucking stab him again. Come on. Go on. Sucker. It's a hit. 18. No, I definitely had it. I'm gonna back away, he can take an alpha tag, and I'm gonna hide again. Okay, so he... Wait a minute. Uh... Is his advantage, so he misses. He's now trying to look who is attacking him by behind. He so he's kind of looking for. Uh, Why he's there looking? Romy is just gonna to disengage, creating an up attack to this bird the devil that is gonna to try to attack her with his glaive. No, and did, did she engage? disengage? No, not engage. No, he, 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 I, I, I said wrongly. He is going to move here, allowing him to give an up attack. He's not ah. disengaged. Uh, he misses. Oh yes, you already sixty. So you can use your divine to win. Okay, so yeah. yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
So you have you still have one. Yeah, so yeah, what's yeah. happened is that he fails this but she's poisoned. So what happened? Yeah, let me see. <coughs> okay, so she has this advantage. Okay, so what has happened is that she's gonna to attack. She's weak, but even that, she's gonna to try to attack the bird, the devil, and the archer with her eldritch blasters. But she's kind of weak she the first one she hits 12 force against this one and then the second one now the blast she misses hits the wall Hententa, that's a throw for Hententa, please uh how, this character sheet does not have that yeah, but you can note somewhere in your sheet, just... Just gotta roll a d20. Mm. Oh, shit. Fail. Uh-oh. Yes. The priest is hidden. Frederick's you. Now you can get close to the door and try to open it. Whoop. Okay, I, uh, I go to the door. I open it. Uh, what do I see? Do I see like a, a straight? You see, you uh, open side? it. You see, you, you you see, you open, and you see the that large bone devil, very injured, and Owen glowing like a fucking star, and loose close to you. When you open, you see that loose look to you. So you have an open vision of the bone devil and the bird the devil, but with some cover because the bone devil is right in front of you. Does my eyes reach Romy? Mm, yes, somehow you can see some brief. Uh, 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 you, not, you have a notion where she is, but don't, you can't see that she's poisoned or anything like that. Okay, uh, so I move a little bit more further in, in here, and I cast Polymorph in Romy. And it just goes, Bring us up this bitch! And going to transform it in what? And a T-Rex. Basic stuff. <laughs> Can you transform it? Remember that you had a, a limitation. What? What is? What is her AC? Uh, the T-Rex is a CR her, her, eight, her, right? Her CR. DC. Sorry, CR. It's five. Five. Okay, Triceratops. 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 You have a very peculiar taste. Triceratops. You just got the mini's biggest. Man. I, I can do a Brontosaurus if you want, but I don't think you have the, this no. shape. That's. I, I don't even know if a Brontosaurus <laughs> would fit in, in the tavern, right? That's the idea. Yeah. Everything goes down. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone that's, that's a triceratops. Eh? Yes, what's happened is that she. Uh, it's Romy. She's pooping on that. Oh, that is. Uh, where is your bitch? Right here. Uh, which is the EC? Let me see. Uh, is a uh, 985 and AC 13. Mm -hmm. She's there, like, ah, and then when you do that, you break the the, the bar and you fuck with Lassie's cover and hiding. Okay. Uh, you, you basically <laughs> brown. And it's then, okay, there's a Triceratops in front of him, uh, yeah. Yeah, the archer just looks and says, what the fuck? 
And then the bird of the devil speaks in Inferno. What the fuck? And I move all my way back. <laughs> and then you just That's hear over. the Triceratops saying something in, in growling or something, but it looks like that is not happy with this. Yeah, but it's not poisonous. Oh, it, stay, it skips poisonous, right? I don't know, to be honest. I think yeah, so. I think that keeps, I keeps poisoned. So you have a poisoned Triceratops that okay, at least you have more HP. Then lost his ability to cast the Blooded Blast. So uh, the gnome is you. You just hear that some kind of beast, another beast, entering this in the first floor. I knew. Because now you're right. Ah! And then you see that what? fucking. Beast is da is there. Yeah, I, I'm large the, and uh, almost eaten the the sailing in the first one. So it's just brrr, and you, you, I'm trying to move myself to the top of the stairs, but I'm really struggling. Why why am I um Yeah here. Why am I have ah oh, thank you. Okay, so you were there and then you just open it and then you see this chaotic scenario of a fucking Triceratops, a dying bone devil, a bunch of bird devils, an archer, your friends fighting this is first sailing that is now starting to fall because yeah. this is a beast inside of it, the front door is the is destroyed, there is a large hole in the front in the front wall. And then you just see that scenario of chaos. And uh, and close to you the 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 the, the the fucking chest is floating like a dog waiting for you older. So I think that, yeah, I'm gonna just fire my uh, hand uh, crossbow at this guy here. Um, there we go. I'm amazed that Nomi didn't have to make a wizard silver. I was in drugs. By the way, I also swapped out your bolts for silver bolt. Uh, yeah. We so course, yeah. Yeah. And then uh, you miss us. It's the floor. Uh. Because that's the scenario. Everybody's there. There's a bunch of magic happening. Just grab your crossbow and hits it. It's the floor. Uh, loses there. She's basically... She's gonna... Uh, let's see what she can do. Uh, she's gonna cast upon you all in resistance. Okay. So you see that she's kind of giving you a, a support. And Harkina looks to the brother devil from top of her and starts to relentlessly <coughs> with two handed long sword attack the fucker and failing. Oh, the second one hits. Uh, cut stop. Give a do a, a cut in the leg of the fucker. Talon is you now. All right, I got this guy right up in my face. Yeah. Yeah. So you have the thing to do. Bonus action, Shillelagh. Fucking hit him over the head. So you drop your long bow and starts to hit him. Yeah. Well, look in your grill. Ooh. One is a powerful hit in the in the head of the fucker. Eleven points. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to um, my movement. I'm just going to rotate around. Actually, I'm going to remember that is to have a bardic inspiration for Gnomi. Yeah. Can I use that for damage? I think that yes. Is it what what D is it? What what size is it? Um, a D six. A D six now? Is this or is it still a, a D eight now? I think his is a D eight. But yeah. I don't know if you can use it for damage. No, I'll use no it. it's not. A, it's not a combat inspiration. D8. It's a part of it. It's not his call. I'll use it for an attack roll. And don't That's forget you have. You have those little extras that 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 Michael has. 
Michael, mm-hmm. could you could you post up all the little extra shit you get from the from your oh, uh, 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 now, Michael, you have that you you have uh, this, yeah this one yeah the okay. motor potential. potential that's it. Oh, that's exactly it. If you use it in an attack roll, it's immediately after the creature rolls the bardic inspiration die to add it to attack roll against the target. The mode you basically creates a turbulent shatters, and uh, the target and each creature of the choice that is within five feet of it must succeed in the Constitution saving throw against your spell. Save this C or take thunder damage equal to the yeah. number rolled. So, so I'll so save it. Good. Okay, I'll save it for an attack roll. Okay, so go on. Or a saving throw if I need it. All right. So the bar the devil is there. Very injured, but still infuriated. And it goes for the attack. As a 27 hits. Yeah. Nine slashing. Hit me. Yeah, 12 hurt. fails, and the sting is a 24. Uh, wait a minute. No, the 24 is... Ah, is 24 that, just hits me. It yeah. just hits so me. So roll for me a constitutional saving throw, please. Yeah, okay. Uh, let me take my uh, the 9 off first. Uh, where am I? Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's go take the, Come the damages. Come on. Uh, Come on, boy. Come on, Tolkien. No, not, not that one. I need to... That one. Negative nine. Okay. okay. Uh, oops. There goes uh, my shield of faith. So let me just fix that. Mm-hmm. I've lost my shield of faith now. Uh, and then I got to roll um, a saving throw. Oh, what's a DC? Just so I... uh, roll the deck. Remember that you have resistance, so you can roll because of... Uh, oh, yes. So you have a D4 to roll to add to your DC. Okay, so I'm just, I'm just going to do that. Roll my constitution. And <laughs> I got to roll a D4. I don't think it's going to help, but, uh, well. Uh, uh, but it still fails. Right? Y- your aura helps you? No. What, what happened? Yeah, yeah. Your aura. Yeah. You have an aura of protection. Oh, I have an aura protection. Yeah, yeah. So I have the, yeah. So I have an aura protection on top of that already. It shouldn't it? It's. I think I should already. It, it, it should already be on there. Yeah, ah. it's just the twenty plus one here that I see in the in the in the dice. Yeah, I don't know what's going on there. It's. it's, 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 it's I thought you had that plus. I think. Yeah, Andy, yeah, like yeah. I did. Modifier. You're you're at a negative one at your con, so a plus two gives oh, you a right. positive one, right? A, a positive one, right? Right. That's it. I forgot about my con. How shitty it is. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Normally it would be even worse. Okay, you're right, so you right, right. fail. So you're a poisoner. It's fine. Yep. It's fine. Yeah. Yeah, I, so forgot, I forgot how bad my con is. Moment. <laughs> So what happens is that you are there, and then you take plus twenty six, take out twenty six from your from your guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, um, twenty six. Yes, thirty piercing, thirty poison, and your poison. Oh, 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 twenty six points. I see. I didn't take a twenty six. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nine plus twenty six. Yeah, that's all right. I'm pretty Ooh. fucked up. Yes, and you're poisoned, so you feel. How this fucker hit hitted you? The archer is there, and now he can see Lazy because of the fucking triceratops there. But scared, he just doesn't. Get, he just goes and do a dash and runs. Oh, and basically, gets out and starts to run outside of the of the. Of the tavern and the bird of devils are dead. This one is dead, but this one is gonna attack Akina. Bird. 21 is a hit. And she is saving throw. Con. She passes. Glaive. Is a failure. She's gonna to attack. With her long sword. Oh, 11, she fa- misses too. Does Tedge get an opportunity attack on that too? Or? <sighs> yeah, boys. Ah, uh, yes! Go on. Fuck. Um, 
Fuck all that. Uh, yeah. Oh, beautiful. Go on. Thirteen. Uh, so go on, you go there and he hits, you see that he opens a flank and then opens the space. This bird the devil just goes here and starts to attack the fucking Triceratops. Birded is 17, is minus 4, okay, and con save for the Triceratops. Damn it. Yes. And the bird glaive. Come on. It passes. Mm. Glaive. It's a miss. Okay, so Alwyn is you. You are there very injured. Your your sworn enemy is there in front of you, also very injured. Yeah. I mean, I'm not, uh, you know, Durith throws are going to stand down or anything like that. Uh, so it's uh, you know, my player attacks. Okay. Now it is going to. Um, he's going to wade forward into it. Uh, eyes aglow uh, with no fear. And uh, totally super misses. Uh, that's. Uh, uh, a it's just roll the damage. Roll the damage. Oh. Only the damage. What is it? What the fuck? I, I don't know. Well, I just. Well, uh, I think my macros are fucked up. Let, let, let me go to my character sheet. There's okay, something on my macros. I don't. I don't. I don't know what to tell you. What have I rolled? That is successful. Yeah. We'll, do, we'll, do, we'll, do, we'll use that damage, I suppose, right? That's the radiant damage, and that's a, the mm -hmm. normal attack roll. Um, okay. Okay. Well, here's a hit. Here's a hit. And uh, before and you do anything, you immediately kills the bone that will cut the head out. <laughs> And brush. And when you do that, all the brother devils see the soul of this this devil being dragged into the sword, and you see that all of them gets it starts to get very, very, very scared and starts to oh. flee. So uh, wait. Um, on their I, turn, I had this advantage. Yeah, on their that. turn, yes, on their turn. But they, they, you realize that their next move is gonna to. Be run away. Okay, um, but I, technically I had this advantage on that, so I'll, I'm going to use my, my last divine... Um, oh, yeah, so you can use it. Uh, yeah, just to say I, I did it to make sure that I hit, okay? Because um, mm -hmm. that's what I would... I would I yeah, would I'm going to consider uh, that I'm going to use it. I'm definitely going to do Yep, because yeah, I don't want to... Just because I, I am still poisoned. Yeah, and with that, I turn towards this bearded devil um, as, as I chop... You know, the, the bone devil's head off. Yeah. I scream at Infernal, your souls are mine. And I go and attack him. <sighs> uh, with uh, Duracell. Oh, uh, you fail. No, no, you, no, you fail. It's, that's the advantage. So you fail. Yeah, yeah, okay. So you're, okay. because that's the scene you are, your, your skin are getting dark and you see yeah. some kind of some kind of poisoning action is affecting you so you're there like very injured uh, and then you hit to hit the floor right hedge is there what you see that the brother devils are is starting to run away so what are you gonna do he's going to spear this one right in front of him for 10 points and if it's still standing, he'll do it again. He is, yes. It's a hit for 10. Go on. Is it not a hit? For 20. For 20, yes. You're almost killing this one. He's bleeding a lot, that dark, pitchy dark blood falling to the floor. Les, you are now. Oh, go on. What is he going to do next? Sorry. Uh, no, I'm just double checking one thing. Okay. No, I'm just. Okay, so Les, is you. You'll see that the devils are running away, that Owen is injured, but glowing. Fucking. Powerful glow getting up, getting, getting from him. Uh, now you're there. This brother devil is preparing himself to flow, run away. What are you going to do? Les is going to mount the Triceratops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
you hear <laughs> some very anno annoying grounds from the, the triceratops. <laughs> What are you gonna do? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna pee my pants on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm going to uh You're stab Sycamus Phobic man, why I guess. I'm gonna stab this uh <laughs> I'm gonna try. Nope. Is a miss. And, uh, so, that's my turn. Okay, so what's happened is that this Triceratops, whatever this shit is, is gonna to Triceratops. He's gonna try to. Where was so, uh, is it going to. Ah, uh, what's the text of this fucker? It's a gore, so she's going to pierce him with this fucking uh, horns. It's a uh, 20 plus 9. It's a 12, it's a mess. That's save for the hand Panta. Ooh. Is, a, is, a is that two stab. passes? Is that two, is that two passes? Uh, uh, it's two passes? Uh, it's, uh, yeah. Hententa immediately gets one hit point and can take its action. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh. yeah. No, it's not two passes. Yeah, it's right. So it's a, it's a critical. So you see that Hententa is there <laughs> trying to. Hententa okay. is uh, not going to attack. Yeah, it's, it's oh, the well. end of the turn. It's in the end of the turn, so it's... No, okay. no, Hententa can make its action, Lucas. Yes, on a tw on, 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 on a, the end of the turn? Yeah, on a, tw on a 20, on a successful 20, on a death saving throw, they get their action. Oh, okay, so go on. So what's gonna do? Um, yeah, I guess... Yeah. Play, to play the... Uh, gain one hit point. You gotta use point. half your movement to stand up, but, you know... Yeah. But he's yeah, yeah. He's, okay, he's gonna he's gonna go after this uh, bearded devil that's on Dallin. Go on. And he's going to put his character sheet away because I didn't think we'd be using it for a little while. Uh, let's see, he's just gonna go charge. Ah, is a miss. It's too injured to do anything, he's just barking and trying to attract. Uh, Frederick, what are you gonna do? It's Frederick! Muted! You're muted, Yuri. My bad, my bad. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to go, uh, go back and hide. Okay, so... Roll a stealth check with mm -hmm. advantage, of course. You are oh, behind the door. Yeah, because you're behind the door. Yay! <coughs> okay, so you're very hidden. Gnome is you. What are you gonna do? Okay, I'm just gonna. Um, uh, I'm gonna try and shoot at this guy again. This one here. Go on. It's disadvantage, remember. You are engaging with him somehow. This guy here? M Mike, you could have did a uh, shocking grasp. Yes, you don't need to. 14. You you take the grasp all away from him. Yeah, Mike, Mike oh. you, got, you got a shitload of cantrips, and they do a, a ton more damage than yeah. your crossbow does. Oh. Yeah. You, can, you know, the, those, those cantrips don't cost any spell slides. You can just, you know, use them. And remember, you have Fireball. You have a bunch of cantrips now. Fireball. It doesn't need, yeah. it Fire doesn't need to fun. rely on your... <laughs> Firebolt is range and Shocking Grasp is melee. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always a cantrip. Oh, well, I have to do that next time around, eh? No, roll, go on, do the shocking grasp. Oh, yeah? 
Do you, okay. You're just getting... Okay, you hit. Yeah. Look at that. So, is it... See? See? Yeah. Use your cool spells. Look at that. Yeah. Powerful one. Uh, okay. It's up. Uh, better than children. <laughs> you go there. You touch this creature. <laughs> you see that your innate magic is starting to emerge, and I believe the shocking grasp. Uh, I think some of the reactions. Uh, I and then Gnome also says, "Can we make some space on the?" Yeah, it can't. Uh, it can't take reactions. So the quick, this brilliant devil cannot take reactions. That's the what shocking grasp does. Uh, so. Till the end of it, or till its next turn. Yes, yes, yes. Take reactions until the start of his next turn. Yes, exactly. So what happens is that they are <laughs> there's there feeling the shocking grasp that you gave against this fucker. And <coughs> what else are you gonna do? Okay, I'm just gonna kick this priest in the bum to try and get him out. <laughs> So right, you see this go. Alive. All right, this all, all looks like a 14 years old girl. So please, careful. Uh, uh, what oh, happened is that loose? Oh, you can this jump down. Me. You can yeah, jump down right here next to me if you want. Yeah. Yeah, you can do it. And while well, uh, <laughs> I was thinking of. I was thinking of giving a cure wounds to um, Awi. You could. You could. I would say no. <laughs> but I need to get this girl out of the way. Yeah, no, but you can walk in, uh, uh, in the same space that yeah. she she's a oh, yeah. It's just a uh, difficult. Mo yeah, it's just. You, you could do a you could do a healing oh, word though, Mike. It's a bonus action, and you don't need to be next oh, to yeah? Awi. Yeah, you already used your uh, action for shock and grasp, right? Yes. So you have give, him a, give, give him a second level uh, healing word. Okay, you yeah. go. Ten points. God. Woo! Woo! Right. So at the same time, you see that you you hear some word that starts to heal you, and uh, you see that uh, the girl is also touching your back. And you will regain plus nine points of healing also, Owen. Harkin immediately Done. goes attack this bastard. Two-handed. Oh, she fails. Open space for a glaive. And he also misses. And can hedge, gonna do can hedge get an op attack on her too? <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's, I don't know if you would like that, but she because what's happened next is that she ex, she hits him and kills it, pierces his heart and kills the bird of devil here. Ah, and goes there. Telling is you, we realize that is just yeah. I believe one bird of devil there. Yep, I am going. No, to... There is a, no, there is one. There is one here. And one here. Yeah. It's up there. I'm going to attack the one in front of me with the, with the shillelagh in my hand. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, beautiful hit. And then um, I'm going to use uh, I'm going to use the uh, coordinated attack. And your reaction. And Tenta Tenta is going to use his reaction to attack. And misses. That's a miss. And, okay. uh, yeah. That's where we're at. Alright, so the Bone Devil's dead, the Archer run away. The Spirit of Devils, bam, this one is going to disengage and start to run. And this one is also going to disengage and oh. start to run away. Ah. Yeah, the three. Do I... This one uh. managed to get out from the tavern. Uh, should I get a reaction and a uh, attack of opportunity on this one? What? Yeah. 
Don't, I get an attack it, it, opportunity. It, it in this disengage. One. No, it disengage. Oh, it disengage. I didn't hear you say disengage. Okay, sorry, sorry. Disengage. Sorry, sorry. Kai, if you had the, the sentinel feet, that wouldn't matter. Yeah, but that's that's another paladin. Right. Oh no, feet, feet. Feet, Sorry, yeah. But there's a paladin, I think, that get. Yeah, but I think there's a. One of the paladins I played one time, I think, had something similar, like the champion or something yeah. has a, 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 the equivalent of that feet. Okay. All right, the Burner yeah. Devils are running away. This one is. It's a little bit. It's the the only one you can, you can see. So what are you gonna do? Um. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I can see this one, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, let's make sure I can. Uh, Twenty feet. Um. Yeah. All right, yeah. Well, then these. Yeah, he's gonna do it. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna run in and lock it from getting towards the door, and then I'm gonna do my uh, my double attack on it. All oh, right. It's a hit. Okay. It's not always um, it's a disadvantage, so no, it's not a hit. Yeah, yeah, disadvantage, yeah. Um, and so uh, I got another one. Um, yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Clicked it, it's not going. So I'm gonna wait, give me a second. <coughs> It's many. a hit. Okay. It's a hit. Okay. Uh, then, um, if that's the case, um, hold up. Uh, I'm going to then use a... What spell slot do I have left? A second level spell slot uh, for Divine Smite on it. And give me a segundo to make sure I fix that properly. Boom. And then second level spell slot, Divine Smite. All right. So... Um, it's that second one with a 19, so that's uh, 16, and then uh, you kill. 30 points. 30 points. It's, uh, it's, you just, again, cut the head out of this, four, this one and start to drag it, so... <laughs> All right. Now I'm going to ask, you're going to pursue the, uh, the bird of devil who run away and the archer that is probably very far away from where you are? Are they going to just uh, stop? No, because it's Durithel. <laughs> Durithel yeah. is going to kill him and run out. Oh, right. So you still have, let's see, I'm going to show you where he is. Let's say he's around. Uh, oh, come on. Give me a fucking job. So you see that he's around here. Okay. Um, well, imagine that this part of the, of the map is just the, 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 yeah, the street. Yeah, it just. It's it's the outside. I understand. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I don't. I I don't think I can do any. I mean, I'll move to chase, right? I mean, um, I already moved. What? To to fifteen feet. feet. I moved. Twenty feet. Yeah, fifteen I, well, feet. So you have it on fifteen feet. feet. Yeah. So I'm gonna take another fifteen foot uh, feet of move action. I, I guess this is the door, right? Yes, the door is around here. Yeah, but okay, imagine sorry. that this place is just a hole in the wall. There's a bunch of yeah. freaks. Oh yeah, okay, yes. So then I would have just, whatever, I'd, I'd be like out here, you know, I'm somehow, I'm trying to chase him. All right, so he's chasing, yeah. adds you. What's he gonna do? I'm muted, sorry. He's going to, he's, does he, he has 30 feet. He's gonna get to like here, or actually like here, right? Mm -hmm. um, and he's going to Eldritch Blast. Okay. The uh, bleeding. Is a hit. Is a hit. Both, both hits. All right. Whoa! It's fourteen. Oof. 18. Oh, does the spirit shroud, does that, uh, does that, that doesn't stack on, I don't think that stacks on. So it's just a 21? I think there's any, any, any attack you make. Okay, so no, that does 
count. Yeah, all, all that. Okay, so you basically there and powerful hits against the creature that is almost dying. Lazzy, <coughs> you, what are you gonna do? Yeah. <coughs> um, Lazzy? Yeah, uh. gonna hop off. Is that how far away they are, Lucas? Yeah, yes, yes, it's a street. Right. You're now getting out of the. I'm gonna attack. Is that the archer or the bearded devil? The bearded devil. The archer is is gone. He's not at your sight. Okay, here we go. Is a hit? That's no, it's not. No, no. Okay, so no, no, I'm sorry, I was just I was just sorry. I was just testing uh, my character. Okay, sheet. you you how you kill this brother devil? Uh, it's back is to me. I'm just gonna uh. Jab the, the dagger in its kidney and then pull outward so its guts spill out on, on the ground. Alright, so the creature just falls and you kill all the. And except the, the archer that is gone, long gone. Huh? You. He only had know. one round of running, right? Yeah, he's, he's probably he... somewhere. I don't know if you want to try to find him. But, but he's, not, he's not inside it, anywhere. No, he's not inside. He just get out and starts. You don't know where he is because he's just run away. Um, but we can't stay here. Lucas, could I try to harvest uh, the the bone devil's tail for its poison? Mm, do for me a let's say a, med, a medicine check to see if you can find the the, the glandules or the stuff to see where you can. I'll help you could, with that. Could I use my poison ears kit to do that? Yes. Yeah. Oh, let's say uh, you can. Let let's say that. What? What? Uh, uh, you're going to use the poison ear kit to harvest, but most of us, you never saw bo a bone devil in your life. Mm -hmm. So why? Where, where is? Where you can find the the, the the glandules? Where you can find the the, the creature poisoning? It's in a in a in a volume that is enough for you to. That's the that's the main doubt. Mm -hmm. can help you. 16? Oh, it's difficult. You never saw Bone Devil in your life. It just starts to cut it and just bang, peach it blood and merge it so you, you're not successful. Okay. You start to make a mess. But that's the situation. All of you are there now. Owen is poisoned. It's just one minute of poison, so... Uh, I don't know if we're going to do anything else. You just see that Romy is there. <laughs> like, like Romy's walking like a, bee, a behemoth in the middle of this tavern. <laughs> Hits the wall. She's not used to have the size. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You've never been fat. Okay. I buy it. Uh, Keep her that way for now if we can. She yeah, can't talk. We, yeah. Could, we could put a hand tenta Permanently. over Romy <laughs> and then use Romy to take all the weapons quickly <laughs> to the place. Uh, as a Triceratops, she has more speed now. Right. We we have we still have like most of an hour on the on the chest. Yeah, in the in the polymorph too, but I don't know how what is the speed of the chest. I'm gonna cast uh, cure wounds. On uh, we can let Hententa and uh, just can move uh, the priest over Horomi for safety. When you start, well, what's happened is that this is the after fight, so you are mm -hmm. how are you? I just want to know because everybody's tired. You can hear the, the priest after. He he listened that the fight the fight stopped, but he he got some courage, went down the stairs, and like, oh my god, oh oh oh, he's kind of frightened. He said, "Devils, devils everywhere." One of them got away. We can't stay here. We gotta go. We gotta move. And then he points to the three ceratops and say, "What is this? There's another one. There's another devil." Like, no, that's your passage. Now get in. There. 
Uh, uh. Get in the dinosaur. Oh. And when he's trying to climb the dinosaur, the dinosaur <laughs> like starts to not allowing that. Romy, it's time to cope with a little bit, okay? And he starts to scream loud. And then you see that Harkina just looks to say, ah, ah, Damn it. I'm injured. But I can't go in on. But if we keep fight, fighting this kind of enemies in the way, we're not going to last so. And uh, 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 who took uh, a critical uh, damage? You took a critical damage, right, uh, Kai? Oh, I was at the beginning uh, of the critical, fight, but I think one. you already asked me to roll a stress check. Yeah, but when you took a critical fight, uh, uh, critical damage, you also lost a level of fatigue. So you, you decrease uh, please a level of fatigue for me. Uh, okay, sure. <laughs> because what's happening? happening What's happening now is that everybody is, by the time the, the passed, since you went to this place, since you arrived from the port and all the stuff, mm -hmm. a, 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 a time like the morning passed, so everybody needs to decrease, if, any, if you're not going to do anything uh, about that, everybody needs to decrease a level of fatigue. Okay. On top of that. So, on top of that, time. yeah, you have a okay, double fatigue. Yeah, just confirmed. Okay. So more fatigue. Yeah. You're more okay, fatigue. If you're not going to cooperate, I'm going to get into you. Uh, and I start climbing, uh, drag climbing Romy. And then she basically starts to get annoyed, but she resignedly... You have a very... Uh, Important blood Angry... Ang angry but resign a triceratops allowing a bunch of people climbing it a bunch just two people <laughs> for her is a lot of as she never was a she triceratops had more before. Of this. come on she's a sucker but she had more people in the know her oh you must it's ask just, her oh. yeah you must ask her <laughs> well I the point the fact is that I don't want to. Yeah, that's what she said. But what what yeah. happens is that uh, you, are in, you are in Elturo and you are getting out, and you see the priest is very. Uh, uh, let me say, how, are you going to to the the? How are we going to keep moving? Because as far as you know, these are and by the descriptions gave to you by the priest, this is the two bridges where the two bridges are. And let's say that you have a brief, uh, uh, more or less knowledge about the location. The, the priest told you that the 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 the, the sh helm should hall is in the west, so you must cross the bridges to reach it. Okay. Uh, which way were the the one that uh, let's kill after fleeing? Did this place to... was this place let me just clarify something this okay. place was kind of seen by Lazzy when he in the beginning he he just flew high and tried to see because the city is covered by smoke mm -hmm. and fire so he saw there is an opening area here and Harkina told you that this place was an area of a market something like that a uh, uh, Shiara's market is a place where were uh, in, in the, the before there was a a kind of a, a, an open market, you know, an open area for merchants and other stuff. And but now is looks like there is an opening area in that place. So okay. When the, the guys the Lazy Kill were trying to flee uh, of the tavern they were were they trying to go to towards this bridge or this bridge? You didn't saw because when no, <laughs> when you, we're, we're, we're not we're not at this location. No, you no, are you the, by, by the ring. Where are we? You are the exactly ring. here. Oh, we are. Oh, okay. the ring is the ring is where you are. Ah, okay. Did we could have been deduce which? No, Lassie didn't bridge. start. No, when when they get out of the tower, they were going towards one direction. 
I mean, not well, the Leslie tavern. didn't saw. Leslie was fighting. Leslie was fighting inside of the tavern. He didn't yeah. saw. Okay. Um, well, so that's a good question. I don't know where he would be retreating. My plan was to get the other bridge around. <laughs> We need to find some place to have a short rest, and we can't do it here. Yeah, it's a place of the it's been a long rest. Short rest. Wh which way did the Bruce recommend? Which bridge does he, uh, does he recommend us to take? The, the you speak you ask this to the the, the priest. Priest is out of bed, very injured, and say, oh, both bridges are under protection, uh, uh, under been held by by devils. But if you want to reach faster, how should how? We need to, to reach Tom's Reach. That's the, the, the first one here. The, mm -hmm. the, the, the upper part. Okay. I say okay, we get we close to... and then we, we short rest in, in an alley or, <laughs> or we break into a house or something like that. Yeah, let's, yeah. let's find some place. Does the priest know of a safe place between here and there that we... And then he looks to say, ah, this was the safest place, as far as I know. I know, this isn't safe anymore. What? But then he looks to say, I believe that more in the north, there is a, 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 a keep that belonged to the order of the companion. And then you know what the order of, of the companion is. The order of the companion was a, a group of paladins exclusively of Eltrell. They mm -hmm. sworn allegiance to... Uh, to the leaders of Eltrell, right? So he knows, he speaks to the, in the north, a little bit in the north, there was a, a place, a, a, a keep, the keep of the twin sons, he speaks to you and say about that. Keep well, we have... of the twins mm -hmm. sons, yeah. but I, 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 I don't know if it's, if they are safe. We just we need were... a the house that... It, 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 it's, we could try, but I, I, I stayed here with the survivors. This place was full of supplies. It, it was the only place that I believe that had supplies, but the keep, I, I don't know how the keep is. I was too afraid to, 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 to walk to that place. We can try. It, it, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's an attempt. We do not need supplies. We need a defensible position. Well, it was a keep. I don't know if it's, it's still active or if it's not just ruins now but it's the only place that I believe that we could try to probably find a, a, a protection or anything like that uh, at this point it's pretty obvious we're gonna have to choose either sneaking uh, around our way <coughs> one of these bridges or strong Do we even really need the bridges? Uh, Frederick, well, can't you turn people into can't you turn people into flying things? And I can fly. No, I can make anyone to fly, but I can turn you into a fly if that's what it asked. But I cannot make a lot of people to do but, this. But but you could turn someone into like a giant eagle, and they could ferry ferry people across the. Yeah. Or, That's true. Uh, but I, but they also have flying creatures that are stronger than ego. All a couple of giant eagles to help and they us. They also have a range of weapons. A giant eagle be easily knocked off, mm. and everyone along. <coughs> yeah. The best way that I think would be everyone to be invisible, and then we sneak around, or just in the middle. I don't think this is invisible so far. At least no these foot soldiers. I have pass without a trace. Keep in mind. Hmm. I, I could use invisibility now and give one, two, three. Yeah, three people. Uh, invisibility. To the worst in stealthing, and then the ones that do not need that much, like me and Lassie, we can just go uh, followed by your. Uh, ah, wait, what is the name? Best of all, Trace. 
could have we could have good chances. And then we <coughs> can have the gnome. Uh, he could catch invisibility on three people too. <coughs> but I think he ha doesn't have the fifth spell That's anymore. True. He's to animate, animate the thing, doesn't it? Um, and someone needs to make the animated thing the invisible. Chest. No, I have a couple of spell slots for invisibility. Are you? But do you have the fifth level? Animation and concentration. He's got uh, a he's got a fifth mm -hmm. level spell slot. I, I don't I don't know if the the features count as concentration for for spells, unless it says you concentrate on it as if it were a spell. Mm -hmm. Oh, the animate thing is a is a feature, not a. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not a spell. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so how many do we have? We have one. Two, three, we four, have, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten people. No, eleven with the priest. And then we have the chest also. Okay. Yeah. So Twelve. We're gonna select six people to be invisible. So Owen, obviously. Can, no. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I, the priest. The the warrior. Uh, Ray at two and the blonde lady that I forgot the name. Remember to write this in the notes, this plans of you, right? So don't forget mm -hmm. it. Have the notes right here. We're still talking though, right? Yeah, but yes, just yes. I just want to remind you that. Mm -hmm. Okay, then we have. So, so far, so good with the invisibility and Pesval Trace idea, or someone who has a, something. Uh, reasonable too. Yeah, we can do that. Okay, so Owen. Uh, Ooh, all is gonna have to make stealth checks. Me and Leslie. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah. The, the, the visibility just grants you advantage on the stealth checks. All right. Uh, two. First, who else? We have four people that we need to give the visibility. Uh, who else do we want to give invisibility, if any? Uh, and is your, is your plan to go straight across the bridge, or are we looking for something? Cross, a, cross uh, the bridge uh, stealthily. Does that even seem... I mean, can Possible. you cross a bridge stealthily if it's, you know, heavily guarded? I, that, yeah, that's, that's, there's, there's, there's a part where it's not reasonable to, to for that to happen, unless there's like a distraction or something. But if you got a small army, I mean, can we really get past a small army? <laughs> well, that's a yeah, good point. We need... We could... Uh, Invisible send cart. someone to take a look at the, the location to see if it's, we can walk True, if don't, there's no barricades or just people by the ends. Because it's just guards in the ends, you can't just walk it with his ability, invisibility pass without well trace. But if they it's have hard. manners like uh, something barricading, doors, uh, anti magical stones, or etc. Well, uh, we can get close and get a reconnaissance to see mm -hmm. if, if the, the, the invisibility yeah. pass without a trace plan is even viable. Yeah, yeah we okay. get it. I Somebody's getting an eye on it. Useful. Yeah. So, While they're speaking, I presume they're speaking inside of the tavern. Did you see mm -hmm. close to you, Lazzy, a very familiar figure looking around and say I finally can that teleportation mixed my senses a little bit but now I'm I'm back and then he looks and say you got to you as you say you you found Gnows outside, right? 
Yeah. Well, I killed him. And then he, you see that he's it's like if he's walking outside, looking the scenario and say, I'm here and that you're trying to pass the bridges. It looks like there are some bridges guarded by devils, but the devils here, they they attacked you. Why? What they spoke about it. You, you, I need information. Well, they, they I'm were, fearing. They were, uh, there was a bunch of people that were working for the devils. And the people would make him believe that they were Order of the Gauntlet. And they were trying to get the weapons from this safe house. But the demons, this doesn't fit, right? The city. And then he looks to say this. This is Avernus, that's for sure. I can feel it. But the demons, this doesn't seem right. You must investigate it, Lazzy. We must see what's going on here. Do, do we really I'm, need to? Do I need to understand what demons are doing in hell? If you want to reach Avernus, uh, you, you, you saw the city's not. Looks like the city. Sh I can feel it by you, but looks like the, the, the city's shaking. We're, uh, we're in Avernus. You are in the city of Ilterau that is in Avernus, but the city is not in the horizon. It doesn't seem that the city is... It looks like the city is floating, I, I presume. Why the city is floating? Why demons are here? I'm fearing something, Leslie. Well, uh, Avernus is the location of where the blood wars occur, yes? Fuck. Well, do your surveillance. Get close to this bridges. We need to figure out what's going on here. Okay. I know that the cities. I know that the blood war is is a part of Avernus, but one thing is know that the blood war occurs here. Another thing is realize that we are in the middle of this shit. We must know the extension of this peculiar thing that we found here. Investigated it. And then he disappeared. And when he disappeared, right before he disappeared, he just looks again to to less in an angrily way and disappear. So you know that Gargalf is somehow annoyed because of the presence of demons here. Okay. So what's the plan? I guess we're gonna go north and uh, do a reconnaissance of, of the bridge. All right. So you go there. <coughs> Everybody is walking together, right? And then you go to the to uh, uh, direction of Tom's Reach, right? Yeah. So you're there. You're walking. You're getting close to the bridge, and then I would allow you to someone go stealthily and see briefly what the what there is in the bridge. What do you think there? I, I mean, I'll, you I'll, got the cloak. Yeah, I'll do that. Go here. Yeah, your your success. We, Let me see. Can we find an alley or uh, do a survival check? Abandoned. Uh, do a what check? Survival. Yes. Uh. Twenty <coughs> three. You found, in the middle of these burned houses, you found one, a small one, is still, uh, is not in ruins, it's not burning, and you see that you can open uh, 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 the door, and looks like a, a very humble house of probably a family. When you enter, you see that the family is inside that, uh, probably killed by devils, but 
it seems that no one is inside of the house, so you can use this place as a shelter for, for okay. and a start a short rest. Yes. So while you're doing this, you go close, and Lazy manages to reach the a place where he can see the full extension of this bridge. You can see that now the, this. Uh, a, under the bridge, there is a, a very, very large gap. Let's see some 30. Let me see how the extension of this gap. Uh, uh, let's me let me measure it. Uh, around 100 feet of gap, and then you can see what is. In this gap, you can see the breach. You see some spined devils guarding the place with a birded devil. Uh, a, yes, a birded devil. And so, again, uh, see some spined devils like this one. But at the end of the bridge, you see looks like a knight riding a dark horse with fire in the exchange of the mane of this creature. And is using a, a powerful um, plate armor. And the vision terrifies you. Hmm. And he's there guarding this place with the the devils in the other side of the bridge. And you also realize, considering your perception check, that in this bridge there are some kind of this is a stone bridge. There are in the floor some runes written. Alongside the, the bridge, not infernal runes, but runes, and it doesn't know exactly what they are. But when you get close to the bridge, uh, let's say that you are around here, you're getting from this alley uh, right here, so you can see more or less. You can see more or less where the full extension of the bridge, you hear Gargalf appearing at your side and say, Lazzy, can you hear? Pay attention. The sound of something happening down the gap. Get close. I need your eyes. When you get close to the gap, and you are very stealthily so, you can hear more precisely the sound of a very powerful battle happening down there. You can see now that exactly what is happening. You can see the river sticks down, exactly down the city, and you realize that you are around 600, maybe 70, uh, 700 feet in the sky floating. So you realize now definitely that the city is floating uh, above the river sticks. You can hear the sound of battle and then, and then you can see what the fuck is going on. And then Guy Gauth just at your side, say, fuck, fuck, fuck. You can hear now, you can realize exactly what is happening. You are in the middle of a humongous battle of the Blood War. 
it's happening in the floor in the in the in the above, uh, under the city close to the river sticks and you can see like tens of thousands of devils fighting tens of thousands of demons you can even see bailers flying fighting peat fiends this very large beast from this beast hordes of that demons get out so i'm going to ask you for a stress check Get him, meow. Get it. Get a desi cream, meow. Woo! No, wait a minute. Not 20 things. No, 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 no. It's wrong the dice. <laughs> <laughs> wrong the you dice. so stressed, it had a panic attack. <laughs> and it falls. Eight points of stress. So you realize what's going on. You see that you are in the middle of a freaking battle of the blood war it's happening down there okay so I'm gonna look at Golgath I'm gonna say uh, the sky is blue and water is wet there's a blood war going on in the Vernus well, what else do Just, you want to know he looks a sad it's not just the blood war, we're in the middle of a battle. Fuck, how are we going to get down the furnace? Shit, shit, shit! It's not safe to get down there. We need to find another way. Damn it! I need to get out of the city. And you know, I believe that I don't have an affliction. I'll have 20 points plus 8. Uh, so I, you are... Wait, wait, was that D20 part of it? No, no, it's the D6 plus 4. I forgot the, the D20, I rolled uh, wrongly. So it's a, it's 8 points. 8 points, 8 points. I, I've only points. got 12, 12 stress, Lucas. Ooh, plus 8. 8, 8, 8. I only had 4 stress before this. Oh, alright, alright. So, yeah. okay, so, okay. Uh, yeah. I, I, I thought that were originally with 12. Okay, so now I have 12 points of stress and realize that Gargoyle get very annoyed as you can see that he wants to get out of Avernus, uh, of Eltorel, and he said, we need to leave the city. We can't do anything, this shit. Uh, I'm trying, but you just gotta, just gotta be patient. I mean, how, 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 how long have you been in the shield for? More than I wanted it. More well, than I deserve it. Well, Find a way. You're, you're as closest as you've ever been to being free. So just practice a little patience. You don't tell me to practice anything. Let's a patient song. You find a way quickly. And then he disappeared. I mean I could so just that's, throw myself down there right now. He's not there to listen to anything. He just <laughs> disappeared. Plus he's just saying that to himself. <laughs> You know that you know that thing like Commissar Gordon when he wants to speak with Batman, then Batman is gone, long gone. Uh, <laughs> like, oh, uh, fuck! Right. So you realize that yes, that blood war. There is a, a very large battle of the blood war happening down there, and that's it. You can return to your friends now and tell everything that you you saw. Yeah, I, I'll I'll return to everybody and tell them that. Uh... What I see on the bridge, nothing about the blood war. Hmm. We can still try to make it our way through it. Probably <coughs> the man and the horse has a big, a higher p p uh, patent than the guys that were after us. That, that you dude, can roll, that uh, you can, uh, Owen, you can roll uh, a religion check to see. Uh, Owen. Do a favor to run and roll a, a religion check because he saw, he saw in the bridge. Uh, the bridge has around 100 feet of this gap. There's a large gap uh, above uh, under the, the bridge. He saw. Uh, Les is not going to tell you exactly what he saw, but he, he, what he describes to you is spider devils, bird devils guarding the place, and this. And you can roll a religion check for us. 
to try to understand what this thing is. So, are 16, we 16, you know what this thing is. This is a Narzugon. Narzugon are fallen paladins who decided to swore an oath, in this case, to Zariel. They died fighting and then they they become Narzugons. So these things are very powerful. More powerful than Gone Devil? More powerful than Gone Devil. Um, with a 16, do like, I know anything? I, mean, I know it's dangerous, but... It's, it, your, your microphone is, is low, I, I can hear. Do, do you know if I know anything more specific? Still low. You're still low. Um, Oh, no, no, we can No, 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 it's good, no, it's good. Yeah? Hello? Yeah, it's yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I just think, I think I need to probably restart my, my computer. This is something, one of the apps updated in the middle of the <laughs> It's messing up. Uh, do, oh, oh. do I know anything more specific besides it's dangerous? <laughs> and no. And what it is? Okay. No. Right. No. Okay. <laughs> do I look? Just, uh, you roll a 24. Uh, well, why do you know? Besides of that, is that these things usually ride uh, nightmares. Nightmares are mm -hmm. unicorns sacrificed in dark rituals, and that things can fly. Oh, yeah. Does he want a fucking nightmare? Yeah, you found your <laughs> you found your nightmare. Daddy, daddy, I want a, I want a pony, but a dark one. I want a pony, but a devil one. <laughs> one that's got fire for feet and shit. Yeah. One of the darkness of hell. Yeah. Okay. How do you proceed? Look, my pony's eating so. Like something like that. <sighs> well, so you know that that thing has a fucking nightmare as a mount and that thing can fly and that things are very dangerous so Mars are gonna very powerful we we can retry the once failed attempt of re making everyone look like a prisoner and make it lazy going for the deception but it, at very really cool it doesn't work it didn't work all the time we could fight them but that's not a good option for neither of us and you can describe oh go on go on we could try to create time. a diversion and at least take the big one away from from the bridge while everyone else passes. Another thing that you describe to your friends is, I presume, that you got to describe the runes that you saw, right? Mm-hmm. Mm. But, but, uh, nice. that, that, that's, that's just this bridge. There are two bridges, so... Maybe the other bridge is a little less, I don't know, formidable? Yes, yes, of course. <coughs> well, yeah, when we spoke sorry. about, when we spoke about uh, the, the runes, you listen and say, you hear the priest say, uh, oh, the runes, that, that runes are, uh, they were ins inscribed a long time ago in that bridges. It, it, that thing, in theory, can can uh, uh, now I would say, uh, uh, move away any kind of devil or undead creature who walks on that bridge. Hmm. There were defensive oh. rooms. Mm -hmm. Any devil. But they're not working you're, you're now. You're certain you're not a devil, right? Just a thing. You can fly. He looks and say... Yeah, but she's uh, a but right, so I to now. What the, what the priest tells you is that that rooms can be kind of... It looks. I, I, I never saw that thing being activated before, but in theory, I, I, I can... With a, a, a specific brain, you can activate that brooms and they can kind of move away the devils or harm them. I don't know. 
it, it's just a, a thing that I, I heard, but if, if you want to pass through that bridge, uh, I, I can activate, I know the, I know the brain, but I need to, you need to cover me. Wait, but you said devil, not demons, right? A a anything of end, a any kind of thing that can... Ah, anything, uh, okay. Anything that can harm the celestial peace of Eltrell. Okay, but... Uh, Lazzy, uh, 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 isn't that guy in the, in the, in the nightmare or the nightmare itself a kind of thing? Mm-hmm. A fiend, so. yeah, it's a fiend. Yeah, yeah it's a nausea, it's, are, are devils. Yes, it is. And it's on the rooms. The rooms but, must be activated. Well, no, 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 the, Must yeah. activate rooms. Oh, okay, okay, okay. The priest, the priest tells thing. you that he heard okay. a long time ago that that rooms wor can work to move away or harm any kind of devil or undead creature or demon, any kind of so, creature from the other planes that can. But he's and he speaks. But that rooms, I Steve, heard that. How to, close to, we have to be? And then it looks. I, I must be on one of the rooms. And as far as yeah. I remember from what I I, I learned here in, in the church, a specific brain can activate it, but it must be. Uh, you must pray for Torm. You must be a priest of Torm or a paladin of Torm or anything like that. A cleric. We if you allow, if <laughs> yes, I am a priest. I can pray it, but I need to. I need you to to protect me here. I, I definitely. How long, how long is the prayer? I, I believe that a, a a minute more or less. It's Oof. it's a long one, but. Very long if you if you if you if you protect me, what if we uh, what, what if we made you invisible? It's a possibility. M must you pray loudly? No, I don't need to pray loudly. I, I can try to pray in a low voice. I, I don't know if this is gonna happen. Uh, this is a, is a kind of a, a legend. Uh, Okay, so let's not precipitate ourselves. Let's have a, have a good point. We still have one bridge to take a look at before we make a decision. Mm -hmm. If you're willing to go there and check, and it also, Lance, we would appreciate it. Yeah, right. Okay, oh. so let's do this next session. You can make mm -hmm. your spells checks. Okay. So just note where, anywhere that um, important information. You must check the other bridge. In this bridge is, uh, has some kind of rooms that you can activate by praying, but it must be a priest of Torm to to do that, uh, or a, or a paladin of Torm or anything like that. Owen was one. He was. was. We used to have. Was. Was. Um, are we taking our short rest? And you're now inside of this ruined house that is still. Uh, up, somehow, having your short rest. With a little loot in the chest. And the chest, I don't know the chest. Everybody's in that, and I, it's Romy still with Triceratops. Yes. Because she's definitely, well, she's not inside of the house, definitely. Right? Yeah, we so need to she's, drop that. And she's, and and she's, tra and she's there, kind of looking to you and saying, like, with an annoying vision, I think she needs to come. Should I drop, drop the, the spell? Yeah, I think so. Okay, I dropped the spell. I dropped well, the when spell. it dropped the spell, it just looked to you and say, next time that you try to pull him off me, I'm going to cut your head out. And then she just jumped to you and started to slap you <laughs> and try to... I defend myself. I defend <laughs> I, mean, I, I guess she had to hit me. She has to really roll the dice just against me. <laughs> okay. So the last event of the session is the traditional uh, fight struggle between <laughs> Romy and Frederick in this eternal fight. So you're taking dodge action? 
she misses. She you misses busy. on me. To... Yeah. She, she misses and then... I'm gonna cut her head out! Motherfucker! Drop it! Drop it! You're gonna be fired! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, you're there fighting. So, remember. Breach, runes, Narzagon, inspect the other breach. It's up to you. And you misses the bitch slap, of course, it, because that's that ridiculous <laughs> scene. Like, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Real rolls high. <laughs> Real hell's on life's offense. You know that couple, couple, that that couple fighting each other, and everybody like looking down, safe. Mm. Uh, fuck, man, I don't need this, really. Okay, okay. Okay, so that's that's the note that write that things that you must do next next session. That's it. We're done. Okay. Nice. Cool. Thanks, right. Lucas. Thank right, you, guys. guys. <clears throat> Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night. Bye bye. Peace. Bye. Peace.